show. show. RTM podcast show. To the world and them girls. Young girl. Spree, Queen Ice Cream. Are you me? In Northwest London, born and raised In Kilburn is where she spent most of her days day. Chilling out, maxing, relaxing, all queening Then her and Mafiella did start diva twinning And young spray well, I was up to no good, no good. Always making trouble in the neighbourhood Did a one liquor ups and the judge didn't care He said I'm sending you to prison right now for two years I blew my mama kissing then when I saw tears The face showed the limit of the face she could bear If anything I could say the sentence weren't fair But I thought, nah forget it, your mom had no fear have no fear, mama. I know I'm only 16, but I'm built for this. Built for this. Huh. That's what Yo, I, I pulled up to the jail around 7 or 8 and I yelled to the sweatbox. Yo, fam, link you later. You later. Welcome yeah. to Feltham. I was finally here. Yeah. They took me to Swallow and it started from there. Right. Yeah. That's where it all started, man. You're just like me, I'm just mm-hmm. like you. I was a bad you too. Bad you too. Mm-hmm. But you could change, man. You can change, have faith, have faith. RTM, RTM. We did a boat. Boom. Welcome to the RTM podcast show, season four, episode eight. Mm-hmm. Everything great. <laughs> Them love to the hate. Come on. But it's a bunch of bait. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so boom now. Um, here with your host, with the most young spray, big bad spray, co-host Cream, you know the vibes. Queen Ice Cream. Um, yep. today we got a special guest, very special indeed. Um, been waiting so long to hear this guy's story. Like, you know, he deserves his flowers. Like, you know, like everyone's always trying to style him. You get real happy to have him here today. You get what I'm trying to say, like. Like, I just feel like this guy deserves these flowers, like, you know, like, he deserves, like, the Garden of Eden. <laughs> he deserves the Garden Fucking of Eden. Out. Do you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> do you know what I mean? Like, um, he's been doing music for so long and, you know, like, gets stopped everywhere he goes. Do you know what I mean? And everyone wants to tell him, like, he, 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 help, he, helped, famous, them, he helped them through, he helped them through their birds and rare, rare. Anyway. I'm the guest today, <laughs> special guest. Um, yes. I'm going to get my story. Obviously, you can't have the whole story. I'm still going to write a book. Remember what I've been saying? I'm going to write this book mm. for ages. You get me? But at some point, you're going to get all of it in a book. But we're going to run through the story. Um, Cream's going to like take up, be doing up host today. You get me? Um, so, yeah. First of all, we'd like to know, God. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if you've yes, watched it before, uh, but we're flipping it around today. Yeah, go on, get Are some, you, get some talking. Come on, get so some yeah, talking so time. Here you go. You're putting, you're putting pressure on get me. Get some already. talking. They always out. like stop talking over cream. Go on, get your talking. Yeah, in. I'm gonna get my talk on today. So, um, yeah, so we've got you on today. You deserve your flowers still, even though enough people don't want to give them to you. Why though? I don't know. We're gonna get into that though, because mm. I'm gonna get into everything. Yeah. And um, I'm going to ask the questions at the people in our ear. You need to talk up a bit. Talk Can you hear me? Am I talking loud enough? Yeah. I hope so. Yeah, so we're going to get into some things. Do you know what I mean? But um, yeah, some f- well, you definitely deserve your flowers, though. We'll get into that. Yeah, no, thanks. And, um, if there's any, any questions that are a bit funny, I'm going to say no comment. You get what I'm saying? Are you? Just no comment. Well... We're going to ask them anyway. No comment. So no, um, no, no, no. <laughs> We're going to ask them anyway. But, um, right, so first of all, first of all, we're going to get into, like, you know, a bit background story and shit like that. So um, where were you born? I was born in a little island called Dominica, not the Republic. A lot of people get it mixed up when I say, yeah, I'm from Dominica. They just automatically think Dominican Republic for some mm-hmm. mad reason because it just doesn't even sound... Like I'm saying, Dominican Republic. And like we just, we have that problem a lot, us Dominicans. We're very special people. It's a little island in between Martinique and Guadeloupe. I even forgot my flag today. Mm-mm. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Waving your flag. My flag. You get me? Right? But yeah, so tiny island, population of 70,000, um, extremely special people. You know, um, I was born there. My mum was born there. My dad was born there. 
So like, yeah, basically I'm 100% Dominican. My sister wasn't born there. Why do you want to know about my sister? Okay, I love, my I love interview. your sister. Shout my out. Big, big up your sis. Yeah, big up sister. Big up sister. Don't start my sis. interview. Young Spray deserves his flowers. So what was it like growing up in Dominica? Dominica was... Island boy. Yeah, island boy. Born mm. and bred. It was, it was lovely, you know. I've got, um, I've got a lot of good memories of Dominica. Mm. Um, I've been hard to kill from the gate because... Um, like basically, I think I was been maybe maybe six months or something. I caught meningitis. Really? Yeah. So I was in hospital for like months, mm. and I think that was my first major operation. And it's nuts because like that's like my first earliest thought because I actually remember lying in lying and just seeing flies flying about. Yeah, but yeah, so yeah, had meningitis had to come through that. Um, um, it was it was good because um, obviously I used to look up to my dad. My dad was a big man on the ends. Um, he was like the MP of my area. Really? Maho, yeah, Maho. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was the MP. Um, my uncle was a prime minister. Prime minister. So fully the first, into the, the politics. First prime minister. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. So man was on the right side of the law when I grew up. You get what I'm saying? But you know what I mean? But yeah, boom now. So was you good when you was little? I was smart. I was troublesome, but smart. Mm -hmm. You know, like I, um, in Dominica, basically, they put you, they, you go to school with like the people, like how smart you, you are. are type of not, thing. So not, from, like, not by your not age. Not by group. age, you get what I'm saying? So like I used to go, I used to do be in school with like people a couple years older than me and all mm. that. Like a child genius, you know. Here we smart. go, whatever. So what was your favourite su subjects in I school? I haven't finished yet. Yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> yeah, I'm saying this is, yeah, we can't be talking about subjects yet. Here this is still Dominica. Mm. It's not subjects like that, yeah. This is so what did they teach boom. you? Everything. Great handwriting, special, special, you, you get what I'm saying? So boom, mm. now. They're in school with all, like, six years, I'm three years old. You get me? If you talk, you're coming to the front of the class, Hitting you on your hand with the ruler, mm. bear smacks to my hand. You get what I'm saying? <laughs> Boom now. Oh, yeah, I broke my arm as well. How? In Dominica, I broke my arm when I was five. Um, so that was the next hard to kill moment. You really what, me? though? How did you do it? Like, basically, there was a girl that lived on my road, Savannah. Mm -hmm. You get me? It's the fancy Savannah. Yeah. And my mum, my mum and dad gone work, so we asked that we used to have a maid. You get me because we was upper class, you get me? Them time. So we used to have That's a maid. Yeah, we was upper, Uptown. We was upper class, you get me? So boom now. And it was raining, I remember it was raining. And then so I've I've cut out the yard, innit, to mm -hmm. go and check Savannah. Obviously didn't say nothing to no one. Boom. Gone up the road now. But it's like the stairs to her yard, there's got no side bits, these. There's no side bits, it's just concrete stairs. And you you got to make sure you're balanced. Do you mm. get me? You got to make sure. Do you get me? So, and it was raining and... Boom. Got up the stairs. you get me? I got up there. Knock. She's not in. No one's answering. Mm -mm. you get me? Turned around to walk back down. I've taken a mad step. I'm down. You get what I'm saying? I'm on my arm. I didn't even cry straight away. That's the thing. I've got up. I've seen my arm is mental. It's broken mm. in a crazy way, like mm. it's definitely broken. You know, like when you look at your arm and it's mm. now I'm crying. You get what I'm saying? <laughs> now I'm crying. I'm run home. The maid, she's scared. She don't wanna phone my mom. She knows it's mad for her. My mom's got a gun. She might shoot her. You get what I'm saying? But boom, <laughs> for my mom. Mom come back. Obviously got mad on me. Went mm -mm. yeah, got my arm fixed. Um, yeah, that's another memory. And, um, yeah, I always also remember another early memory was when me and my sister see the police. They shot someone outside our house. Mm -hmm. They shot him dead and then he was rolling down the hill. That's another memory. Mm -hmm. um, got that bit of mad memories. I used to like going to the beach. Um, we used to like going to the beach, Donkey Beach. And um, go 
Coconut Beach as well. We used to love going to Coconut Beach. Um, yeah, it was just these like it was just nice island life. You get what I'm saying? Um, so how long was living, you? Been, how long did you live out there for? I came here when I was nearly um, when I was nearly seven. But basically, that was before. That was because my mum, my mum and um, dad got divorced. So mm. yeah, so yeah, I used to live with both my mum parents. Then they got divorced. And um, yeah. Do you remember that? Yeah, yeah. Like properly. Do you know how you? How did you feel then? Was you sad to leave? Did you want to leave? Do you know what? Like, it was mad, yeah. Because what I do remember mm. is um, I was excited, kind of. I was excited. Was you? Yeah. So you wasn't you wasn't like one of them kids that was sad when your mum and dad broke up and stuff. Oh like no, that. no, are you talking? I thought you said when I left Dominica, you did, but boom, when they broke up, mm. um, I used to still see my dad in it. I don't mm-hmm. think it caught we caught nothing too much. What was like about the ins and outs type yeah, of thing? Yeah, but you still you used to still get to see my dad because mm-hmm. he had his office in town and that. So still go and see him. Obviously, um, like where we moved to, obviously it's not as nice. All this stuff, like, oh yeah, another early memory when my mum bust some gunshot after one burglar. Oh, for real? Yeah, my mum did bust up some gunshot after one burglar, and she was pissed that she missed him. Mm. Yeah, she was upset she missed him. Come on, R.I.P. My mum sounds gang, like stomach, like that you get me. bad guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. R.I.P. Um, um, yeah. So where we was living, obviously, weren't as great, mm. but we had um, like we had name type of thing mm-hmm. on the island, so we kind of went through. But yeah, leaving Dominica, I was a bit excited because obviously, England, like you see it on TV with the snow and all that shit, like man's excited to come there, isn't it? Mm. And um, like I had an older brother and an older sister that had already, because their dad lived in England. Okay. You get me? Yeah. Um, and I think they'd gone already to England to live with their dad mm-hmm. for like a, a few months or something before we um, came. So I kind of missed them because we all used to like play together. Mm-hmm. It? So you wanted to come? So yeah, yeah. So and I still used to talk to like my brothers and sisters. And they used to talk about they got these com- computer games and all this shit. Mm. The man didn't really know about. It. So yeah, I was excited to go there, innit? And then, yeah, I just wanted to see the snow. I just remember wanting to see... I've never seen snow. Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? All I know about is sun. Like that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I just wanted to see snow till I actually saw it. But yeah, that was Dominica. But uh, yeah, I remember being excited. Excited to come there. But then... Came here. Um, and then two, we there for two years. What did you think when you first saw it? When you, when you first got here, what did you think? Um, I saw London in comparison to like you know all that blue and yeah it was just like a concrete jungle in yeah. it it's like just a big concrete jungle like everyone's saying in it in it and all that shit yeah, yeah it was just different it was a culture shock because mm. obviously back then it wasn't as diverse as it is now mm-hmm. you know so wasn't as integrated or whatever and so. you must have had your accent and everything yeah the accent yeah I was, yeah I had my accent when I first come here, I was talking like, this <laughs> like how you laughing, everybody just laughing at mm-hmm. after me. So when you came here, you was in what? Still in primary school or sec? Yeah, still in primary school, obviously. I just started primary school. Yeah. So um, how was that? Yeah, it was. It was. I liked primary school. I went Barclay Juniors mm. in um, Leighton. When we first come here, I moved to. Um, we was living in Leighton, James Lane. Um, James Lane, right by Abbott's Park. Um, yeah, so I went Barclay Juniors. That's like the heaviest um, primary school. You get me? I met a lot. In of what area? Leighton. Leighton. A lot of people that I would end up knowing, like you know, my whole life. Mm-hmm. You get me? Friends that turned into enemies. Mm-hmm. Do, 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 do. do you get what I'm trying to say? But yeah, we we had good. It was a good, um, good base. You get me? Um, yeah, and I learned a lot. Obviously, people at first, mm. they used to laugh at my accent or whatever. Mm-hmm. But then, we just got... Got, got used to it. Yeah, we got used to the accent, changed it up, switched it up real quick. 
Me and my sister. My sister was obviously my best friend. How much years between you two? One year. Oh, okay. Yeah, so she was just like, yeah. She was my best friend. And them times, to be fair, in primary school, she used to kind of look look off to me a mm. bit. Because she was still like the big sister. Mm -hmm. So it's like, yeah. I remember one time, well, R.I.P. Lama and my little friend still, but he used to try and trouble me. You get me? Mm -hmm. When I first come there, like, take the piss out of my accent and all that. I remember one time he tried to grab my... Cause you see what? Oh, my gosh, how can I forget this? My mum had us on dance hall. You get what oh, I'm saying? She had us on Calypso dance hall. <laughs> so when we've come here, Barclays now, you can... You're allowed to wear your own clothes. Mm -hmm. Or there's uniform. My mum's bought us uniform. Yeah. <laughs> She's bought us uniform. Nobody else wears uniform. uniform. <laughs> Everyone's in their own clothes. <laughs> Straight away, I'm getting... Yeah. Bullied for this. <laughs> you get me? Yeah. You've got a mad accent and you've got uniform. uniform on. You're mental. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? So, Larmin <laughs> is trying to do madness. Do you get what I'm saying? Larmin <laughs> wants to grab my, he's grabbed my tie in it because why have you got a tie? Where's Larmin from? Larmin's from my ends. No, no, what what ethnicity is he? He's Gambian. I swear oh, okay. he's Gambian. Oh, the name. My little friends still, yeah. RIP. Rest in peace, Larmin. Rest in peace. Yeah, but go yeah, on. So, Lamp to you, get me? Lamins, grab my tie. You get me? <laughs> Boom. Smack to the face, though. Do you get what I'm saying? Smack to the face. A Dominican smack to the face. <laughs> Boom. But he's still on me. Like, you know, he took the smack to the face. He wants more. You get me? He wants this to be ongoing warfare. You get what I'm saying? Got to my sister. You get me? <laughs> Make my sister know. There's alarming. You get what I'm saying? He's. Moving alarming, you get what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, this is his pattern that you get me yeah. sorted out. But alarming ended up being my good friend. Died off a um, he died from a um, what do you call it when you can't breathe properly? Asthma. Asthma attack. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Uh, my, my dog. But, mm. but yeah, um, made some good early friends that uh, in there. So was you good at school though? Apart from that. Do you know what it was with school, yeah? Because I was so smart mm -hmm. in Dominica. When I've come here, I'm now with people my age. So one of my early memories is when they were trying to make us do the ABC, like join the dots, like A, mm -hmm, B, C, mm -hmm, or whatever. Mm -hmm. By that time, I could already write joined up, innit? So it's like, it's just boring, innit, mm. for a bit. So then I kind of had to dumb down a bit. So, yeah. But, um, yeah. Link couple people, um, Stephen Foster. That's like my early. That's like he. He's like the earliest person that I remember like making proper friends with in primary school. Mm -hmm. and it's nuts because we ended up falling out, but that was like the first. Do you know what I mean? Like man showed me little bad stuff, like you know, like teeth in from the shop, and he used yeah. to come to my house and just do mad shit. You get what I'm saying? So, yeah. Um, Sting, Daniel Allen, big up Daniel. He's a bad kid. Asher Phillips, a bad kid. You get me? Turn into a good kid. I got some good memories from from um Barclays. Larissa, you get me? Yeah. Larissa. <laughs> <laughs> the way you said that. Now nah, Larissa was the look at old thing, but she my bridging being mother now, so I can't yeah. even overkill it. Yeah. But you get me. Okay, and then so what? Where did you go from there? What secondary school did you go to? Um, I went holy family, but before then, mm -hmm. going back because obviously I got to help you out in it because there's things you wouldn't know to ask and then so I got to help oh, you. Oh whatever. Out. I go got to help what you out because you're going. Cause I went back from, from primary my, school. I went back to Dominica. Oh, did you? Yes, yes, for my mom and dad to get divorced because obviously they've been divorced, but they hadn't had the proper um, thing. But I'm just going back to like oh, okay. how I felt in it. Yeah. Obviously, two years later, I've gone back. To, um, yeah, two years later, we'd gone back. I remember I'd, I hadn't seen my dad what, for two years. to make everything years. official and that? Yeah, yeah. Mm. So I haven't had, I haven't seen my dad for two years. I haven't, so it's a bit different, innit? Mm. To feeling excited to wanting to leave or whatever. Actually going back, when I went, I remember going back there and then when I was leaving that second time mm. to come back to England, that's when I felt it. Did you? yeah. yeah. That's what I was going back to when you first asked me, how did it feel yeah. leaving? Initially, 
I didn't really mind. But then when I went back there, because mm. it's my home, innit? Mm -hmm. So it's like I've gone back and it's my home. Mm. So now it's like, oh, shit. And then when I was leaving there to go back to this England place, I felt it. I remember that. Like, I remember. You never want to come. I remember when the plane left. I, yeah. I went. I, man said I went. I was crying still. You were. <laughs> okay. Yeah, he was about to say. Yeah, I was about to lie. But yeah. it's really the most. I was crying yeah. still. But I didn't let no one see me cry. You get me? My mum yeah. didn't see me cry. I just put my hand on my lap and I was bawling still. Mm -hmm. You get me? That's when I remembered like, no. Nah. And it's mad because after. Barred again when I left, and then I never, and then I never went back for like twenty one years. Really? Mm. But yeah, boom. Did your dad ever come over here? Hell no. My dad's a, that's what I'm saying. Me and my dad's relationship kind of broke down. Yeah. Because obviously, but I get it, innit? As a big man, I get it. Because it's like I just think to myself, right? If my baby mother done that, like took my youth somewhere to the next thing, and then after a while. They're just not even phoning me, car. I just mm. stopped phoning. Do you know what I mean? Mm. I'm my dad's son in it, so I might just say fuck them as well. You did he me? phone you he, as well? He got a new. Um, did he phone me? Mm. He used to, but I remember the last time I heard from my dad was when I went prison. That's mm. forward in. That's fast forward. You get what mm. I'm saying? Yeah. Mm. He sent me a. He sent me a letter in it. In prison, and like he was kind of like dissing my mom and. You know, like, because he couldn't believe it because of the you, what he knows, because I was so clever or whatnot, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. to find that I'm in prison. Mm. Tried to, I didn't, I mm. just written back chatting, bare madness, like, do you get what I'm saying? Mm. So from that, he just, he thought, fuck this, you. And I just never, me and my dad never spoke again. Yeah. How old was you? 16 when I went to jail. And 16 when you never spoke to him again? Mm. Yeah. And how old was you when he passed away? I went to my dad's funeral, mm. 2016, the year before my mum died. I went to, I, that's the first time how, I see him. My mouth is, how old was, does that make you? You're going mad, that don't how matter. How old? That don't matter. You get, I'm, I'm just letting you know, I went there in 2016, boom, you get what I'm saying? So boom now, yeah, mm. as a big man. And that was the next, the next time I saw my dad was in the coffin. Mm -mm. Do you know what I mean? But it was... Oh. When I went, yeah, RIP, but when I went to his house and all that, he still had my picture. Yeah, come on. You get me? No, because it's not even come on. I thought, I thought he'd fuck me off, innit? No, but, like, but I reckon he would Even like my, have his my people, them, it was like, nah, my man rated you. You get me? Type of thing. Mm. But, um, yeah, so going back to... So basically, coming going back to when you went to Dominica and then you came back. So that's when yeah, you said that you no, felt it and all of that. Yeah, yeah so we've then, gone past so then, that. yeah, no, I was yes. Asking about secondary school. Yeah, so then that's what I'm coming. That's what I'm yeah. coming to because yeah. then we went into your dad's stuff. Yeah. So then, yeah. So then now that is secondary school. Mm. So what secondary school did you go to? We know this Holy Family. I've said it bare times. Flow yeah, down. We got flow down. We got Ozzy B. Oh, we got flow down on Lethal, the last episode. Lethal B. As well. Yeah, we got flow down for the last episode. Very good episode. My big brother, yeah. Mark Verrier. You wired me bare times, though, big brother. You wired me bare yeah, times. Did, you get he me? He did. He did. He did. He wired he me a few times. You. Still, you get me? And that, <laughs> you get what I'm saying? I, you get I, keep, me, I keep getting it wrong with these shorts, though, man. Fuck you know. But this one's a bit better. Yeah, this one's a bit better. I keep getting it wrong, though, man. But it's, you get me, it's the Zara, Zara thing, you get me? <laughs> yeah. But um, Holy Family College, Holy you get Family me? Holy Family College, yeah. So um, when did your mum get into teaching? Because I know your mum was a my teacher. My mum was teaching. When she came over here. My mum was teaching, I think she was teaching from Dominica. Because mm -hmm. she used to um, she used to work in social security. Mm -hmm. That was where they give her the machine and boom, boom, boom. And they get the license to kill them too. Cause you love it, innit? Yeah, yeah, love he it loves it, you know. I love it, mum. You know, I read, 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 I still, read, I still, big up, mummy. Um, and enough, no, loads of guests that we've had. Quite a few guests have been um, had there as their teacher as well. Um, Do you remember a couple of people come on here no, and said, "Yes, it was. It was her. more than they know her, but they it was more than still. one person that said that she was their teacher." Do you know what I mean? I can't remember who it was. Slim Ting. She used to teach Nikki Slim Ting. But somebody else come on here as well. I can't remember any guest that yeah, was. Yeah, it was. Someone they, came they on here. Know, they would know her. Because like, remember, yeah. Mark, Mark done a work experience. Flo done done work experience with her. You mm -hmm, were saying. Mm -hmm. I 
can't remember what test. What what um subject did she teach? She's done primary school, so she was like they teach kind of all around. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think she used to do like she was like the PE teacher and like the main PE teacher. I think. Mm. So when you got into secondary school, what type of child was you then? Um, I was um, I was a good child. And what subjects did you like? Um. I was always, I was always liked English, mm-hmm. English. Um, I was good at geography. And PE. Really. Yeah. And so, as so, you was a good child. You didn't act up at school or nothing like that. No, no, mum was acting up, but yeah. it was more like we was just on more jokes. Yeah. Like you know, I used to make the teachers cry and all that. You Certain were just teachers. Just having fun. Yeah, 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 it wasn't like. Full on mm. madness. It wasn't like I weren't battering teachers with table chairs and all that. Mm. You know and who I'm was saying? you listening to? Who was your influences and all that? What was you watching? Like who was your art? Um, like your favorite like artist and stuff like that. Them um, times when you them first times came I over. think when I first came, I'm over, like you're going mad. You're going like mad. secondary school. Yeah, that's secondary, yeah, secondary school. Secondary schools. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like I was more on sound tapes. I remember correctly. Bashman, Yardy yeah, stuff. Tips, like yeah. Um, Stone Love. Come on. Kilimanjaro. And you know when they yeah. used to have the sound tape? Yeah. It was more like that for me. But we're going back to like 92, 91. Was your mum strict? Of course. Is it? Of course. But she had five kids. Mm. So it's like, and homework to do every evening. Mm. So no matter, you, I'm still going to fly under the radar. You get what I'm saying? Come yeah. What it is, is like, I was very good at styling my mum. Mm. Like, no matter what I do outside the house, I could come in the house, I'm still a baby, innit? Mm-hmm. So, she used to always, like, just go mad on them. Like, no, nah, like, she never used to believe them, innit? When they used to say whatever, she'd be like, no, nah, no, nah, nah. Because I used to say to her, no, nah, they're trying to say, they're picking on me. They're like, picking oh. on me. You get what I'm saying? But she used to, she used to believe me, innit? Mm. Mums and their sons, though, especially like if you're the young one, you know they, you, you know in it, like they always spoil them or baby them up. Do you know what I mean? Mm. Mm. So towards the end of school, so how did you do anyway? Did you do your, did you do your exams? Yeah, I got I got expelled. I think I got expelled like six months before the end of school. Really? Yeah. So it's like, so basically. There wasn't no time to pick another school. Mm. So I just had to, like, do home. Like, they just sent the work home type of thing. Mm-mm-mm. I just had to wait to do my exams. Yeah. But they still let me sit the exams. Mm. Did you do well? I got, How did you do? Yeah, I did well enough. I got five. I, no. I got... I got five Cs. Five Cs, four Ds, and one A star. Come on, that's all right. You get me. Yeah. What did you get your A star in? English. Mm. Okay. English. And I that English was my favorite subject because like the teacher really like I got on with the teacher Miss Keo. I really got on with her. Yeah. She get me. She just saw good in me in it. Where they all used to see madness in me, she see good in me. So um, what did you um, what did you get expelled for? Got expelled for some idiot too. Because what? what I actually got expelled for was I remember I was smoking. Like we used to, we used to smoke. We used to go up to the f- top playground and smoke. And then one time, me like an idiot, wanting to impress with while I was smoking in the corridor. And then they just put up. They just put up um, cameras. In the corridor. Yeah. yeah, they just put up cameras. So I remember I smoked, and someone said, "Hey, fam, you know they put up cameras or whatever." I've turned around, I've seen the camera in it, mm. yeah? So then, I've walked underneath the camera and I smashed up the camera, yeah? I remember I smashed up the camera with a book. But bear in mind, the camera's already still filmed. It's filmed me smoking and then walking underneath. So they've seen that and then uh, there was some next youth that was in the camera and he basically G'd it up, you get me? Yeah. Because they've, like, they've asked him and he said, oh, yeah, well, Sharif Malik, yeah, 
Yeah, yeah. Oh my God, you beat him up, yeah. <laughs> now, I used to use his name. I used to know all his details. I used to use his name. That's I one of my lie. aliases, yeah. Mm. That's one of my aliases. But yeah, um, <laughs> flipping. Yeah, he G'd me up still. Mm -mm. And then, yeah, they expelled me for that. Because mm. it was just like accumulation of. You get me? Bad just, behavior. Yeah, yeah. Wanted you out. It's just, it's just a bit stupid, isn't it? It's a bit silly, isn't it? Yeah, but you can't be smoking in the club. It's just, it's it was just silly. Do you yeah, get what I'm saying? Like, yeah. what are you doing? Like, it's just yeah. dumb, isn't it? So, after school then? Mm. So, what happened after school? After, sc after school, I tried to go, um, I tried to go college. Mm -hmm. I went, um, I went Monarchs, George Monarchs at first. What did you study? I think I picked sociology, psychology, and English language and literature. Mm -hmm. But the problem with college is I thought this is the end of school. I can go when I want, whatever time I want. You can just turn up when you want. Yeah, turn up when I want. Do you know what I mean? Not realising that they monitor your attendance. Yeah. So it's like... Uh, so I just basically just go in whenever... Um, so I come, I came in late a few times, and then I think on about the third day or the fourth day, I come in mad late again. Mm. But now the teacher's trying to say madness. Do you get what I'm saying? He's like, "Oh yeah, can you apologise to the class?" <laughs> Do you get what I'm saying? So I'm thinking, "What is this? Mm. This is mental." So I'm mm. even saying, "I don't need to do that, sir. <laughs> I don't need to apologise to the class." You get me? He's letting me know, apologise. Get so I'm even looking at the class, innit? I'm mm. saying, do you not want me to apologise? They don't want me, they even say no. They, I'm mm. heavy. They know I'm a heavy. You get me? They've already clocked. I'm not on what they're on. You get me? I'm not really on what they're on. You get what I'm saying? I'm coming in when I want. They can see my things a bit mm. looser than theirs. You get me? So they're making him know, sir, it's fine. We don't need him to say sorry. You get what I'm saying? He's not listening he wants me to go and wait outside the class. You get me? Yeah, wait outside. He told me to wait. I've gone. You get me? Mm -hmm. God, yeah, this is too crazy. I've touched road. You get me? I tried to come back in the next day. You get me? Mm. They want me in the head. They want to talk to me now. They're telling me, look, hasn't been a week yet. <laughs> we suggest you find somewhere else. <laughs> it's, it's not like started. You get what I'm saying? It's not started too well. Yeah. We said, so I, then I, I tried to go epping. I went Epping for a bit. That didn't work out. Then I went Redbridge and then I went Felton. Yeah. Oh, you weren't in the copies. Yeah, so what happened when you went to Red? Where's the one before you went to jail? What was you doing? Why didn't you work out? Just the same thing, innit? Like, mm -hmm. just. So what did you go to jail for? Um, robbery. For real? Yeah. And it was a robbery committed when I was fifteen as well. Mm. It was just been it's just been ongoing, like going back and forth court. Mm -hmm. I wasn't expected to go, but they felt they needed to make an example mm -hmm. out of me and my Cody. So yeah, it gave us two years, which at that time was kind of a big bird for us because, like our friends or whatever people our age will be. They might go to jail, but they get like a six months. Yeah. Do free, you know. So, yeah, it's not. How, mm, how mm. did you feel? Yeah, you must have been pissed. Do you know it was mad because I didn't give a shit. Didn't you? No, I didn't. Because by that time I was already like, obviously you haven't asked me, but I'd already been into crime. You know, by that time. Yeah, because I was asking you about um, college, that's why. Yeah, so no, during college, you saying, started... I was into crime. For real? You know what I'm yeah, yeah. So no, what, before, from when you from left school, school? From school, crime. From really? School, crime. Sometimes not even going to school to commit crime. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Sometimes. Supposed to be in school. Instead yeah, of school, I'm in someone's house. It's getting burgled. Allegedly. <laughs> Do you get what I'm saying? Stuff are getting taken away. We've got a link. We bring in all the stuff. We're getting paid the money, we're splitting it. We're heavy. So he you see, me and Max, like, Max has come on hard, like, we're doing little criminal shit. Like, mm. just bits and pieces, we're just trying to make money. Money. Like, even clothes, like, man, this is 
Like, just a lot. It was just to do crime. Yeah. I was just very, very interested in crime. And it's like the people I used to look up to was bad people. Like, just, I, I would look up to people from my memory is criminals. Like, there was a guy from my area called Jonathan Smith that I used to think, like, was... I used to probably look up to them. Mm. And I remember one time, it's so mad, because my cousin's from, like... My cousin's from, like, um, West. And, like, I always remember, like, me and him, he used to say, oh, yeah, have you heard of Mark Lambie? Very, very, like... But I hadn't heard of, of, of Mark yet, the big man. You mm. get me? Like the big man. I hadn't heard of him yet. Mm. Come on my ends. I know about Jonathan Smith. Mm. So I'm saying to my cousin, nah, fam. Jonathan, <laughs> we used to always have, mm. but that's what my influence is. Right. Do you get what I'm trying to say? Yeah. I used to look up to bad people, Jonathan, Simeon. And so I used to, you know what I'm saying? Mm. And um, yeah. So, and I had a Cody that was like kind of cool then. Bear in mind, I'm a man with no brothers in the game. I know you didn't ask me about my siblings and that, but I've got like two brothers two sisters but they weren't in the game you get what I'm saying so it's like I was like more looking after my son in the streets yeah so but I had a brethren that was kind of like a good friend that was like in the mix in it so he used to come bring me go this person's yard go this person go so we used to link with them still them bad people and like yeah I used to I, I just liked doing Shit like that, or being with them sort of people. Mm. So, like, when I went jail, I can't remember when I first used to hear about Felton. I used to think, like, where, where's this Felton place? I thought it was like a, some summer camp or something. Until I, you know what I mean? Until like my bridging school, me, no, it's like, look a prison or whatever. So, every, most people I knew had gone and Felton already, like. So, you didn't even care that you went? You was no, I didn't care. It's like, even like my bridging, like one of my good friends, Eric, big up Eric. His cousin Gusty, we got Gusty. Gusty was heavy as well at them times. So I used to look up to Gusto's. Um, but he'd already been for him. Mm. And I remember like just hearing little stories or whatever. I never I never thought I was never scared of prison, innit? Like that. Because I know people that gone there, innit? I was more like just like whatever, innit? Like it's just somewhere you go, innit? Type of thing. I just didn't like the bird, like you know, like yeah. the twos. I was like, whoa. Get me. What did your mum? Your mum must have gone on at you, though. What did she say? No, she didn't get on at she? me. She was just very upset. Really? Did yeah, she's not gonna get anything? on. Anything? She wasn't gonna get on. If you get me, you've only got two hour visits. She's not gonna use that two hours to be chatting shit. You get me? And that's when she come to visit me. You get me? Some like I never got visits for ages. Mm. But did it bypass? By it? that time, she she knew in it. How did that? How did that bird? How did that bird go? Did it fly by? Did it take long? That first bird, mm. I wouldn't say it flew by, flew by, because it flew by to begin with. But um, that was the that was the bird where I'll talk about that kid lazy man. He got oh, lazy. Oh, is it? <laughs> yeah. That first bird, you get me. Mm. Done couple shit parts, but I was just like, no, I just did it like authority. So it's like after that thing with Lazy or whatever, I got done for bullying. And then Did you shit, get into enough fights in there? They shit couple fights still, but that was the one loss. I just everyone they reposting the loss. Mm -hmm. You get me, but <laughs> there was wins. You get me. There, yeah. <laughs> there was wins in there. You get what I'm saying. Money even yeah. smacked up something in Feltham to even get to that loss. You get what I'm saying. But mm. boom, yeah. So that um, that bird. Yeah, after I got down for bullying, they sent me Only. Mm. And, um, yeah, I liked Only. Like, I stayed in Only till I, um, till I came out that time. But, what yeah. What do you like about it? Not even like, it's just, just the people, like, in, um, there's, like, a couple of people from my ends up there. Mm. Action. Um, we got Daniel. Daniel was in there them times. That's where I first met C1 as well. Okay. Um, that's where me and C got that little pattern there. Um, there's a couple of people in there. Most kid. There's a couple of people in um, Only still. Mm. You know. Um, yeah, they had gym every day. That's what I liked about Only. Gym every day. You get me in them times, man, trying to get tongue. Mm -hmm. 
and um, yeah, went on H wing. I was doing up, but uh, yeah, I mean, I was going on two heavy and H wing. No more L's. What happened? Have you got any <laughs> stories you can give me? H wing. What I can. Do you know I got one funny story yeah. from H wing? Because I used to always just chat shit and just have jokes here. Mm-hmm. But I remember one time we was in the um, big up Francis as well. My nigga from um, Brum. I see him the other day. And yeah. he even reminded me. Because he's like, yo, don't you remember it? Like, he was like, yeah, dude, you used to be. Tried to say I used to be physical, but you used to be physical. I was like, nah, my man's still fizzy, but yeah, boom. Remember, we was in the TV room, and then, like, you know, you had the new people come come true, mm-hmm. and then one youth must have come, one white boy come, and he had some funny trainers. I remember one time, and I tried, like, have a, I tried to have a joke, so these trainers or something, you know, like, I was just one of them guys, like, all right, you didn't have it, you gave me, mm-hmm. you wanted to fight, you gave me, I couldn't believe you wanted to fight. But yeah, that was a little funny one. I had a little rock with him. You get me? And then next time I had a little rock done, I had a rock in church. In church? Yeah, I had a rock in church. Cause that's what I'm saying. Only them times it was like... No, yeah. I can. You're fighting in church for... I just remember, the man was just chatting shit. It was something to do. Like, some white boy argument or something, but mm. you get your man's in there having a fight. You get what I'm saying? One of them's like picked up a chair. It was just bare. Yeah, I got ten extra days for that. Mm-mm. But um, ah, oh, you know what? I'll give you a funny story. Cause I remember after that, after I had a fight, I had a fight in church, and then I was down block. Mm. I remember I got seven days down block, seven days lots of seat, lots of canteen, whatever, whatever. I come back onto the wing. Just before I went block, there was a new. He's actually from right here. There was two twins. One of them was called Adam. Can't remember what their surname, but meaning was all reasoning. Mm-hmm. Before I went down block, he was reasoning. I thought, oh yeah, this youth's all right, whatever, whatever. Boom, I come back on the wing. We got footy as well, man. Next door from Leicester, yeah. But boom. So now my man's come. He's like, yeah. Yo, spider, spider, them time minutes. He's like, yo, spider, you got a burn, you got a burn. But I'm saying, I ain't got a burn, man. Yeah. But there's something wrong with this you. You get what I'm saying? And then it's gone from do I have a burn to that you told me suck my mother. And mm-hmm. I was like, what? Because obviously in jail, that's just it's just that now. Isn't it? Fighting yeah. words. Right. Come on. So boom, I want some makeup. I want to put six LR twenties. There was like the big batteries in it because we didn't have a plug socket them time. Also put six big batches in a sock ready for him in the morning. I'm all saying, yeah, I'm gonna do up this you. But I was pissed because I've just come back, innit? And I just keep getting extra days. And I remember C1 and a couple of times they're telling me, you know, allow it, whatever. Boom. Cut a long story short. Morning come. They've opened up my man first. And then they opened me up. And I remember, I remember coming out. And then I'm seeing this huge face and he's like smiling, like, you know, like trying to, he's forgetting his beef, you get me? That's what I'm saying, there's something wrong with the you. So then, yeah, like he tried to run off, man got him, boom, bust his head, you get me? Mm. He's falling down, boom, went back to block. But yeah, I got, um, I got, um, I lost like six months, extra days, Mm-mm. that sentence, Mm-mm. you know. Um, so when you came out, what happened? Yeah, I came out on my 18th birthday. Could you do music birthday. when you was in there? No, I came oh. out on my 18th birthday. Yeah. On my actual birthday. Mm-hmm. And that's what, like, I remember when the, the the last time I lost, I lost extra days for, um, because they used to just chat shit, innit? And I just used to listen. So I used to get a lot of um, disobeying direct orders. Um, that was basically what, like, oh, I lost days yeah. for disobeying yeah. direct orders. And I remember one time, Lost, I think I lost a three days or something. But whatever I lost, it ended up coming on my birthday. The extra day that like, actually fell on my birthday. So I thought, oh my gosh, like, I'm not doing nothing think, else, you yeah. know, like. And I remember that, and I had like about three months left or something, and I just mm. literally didn't do anything. You was obeying them, my orders, boy. I just stayed, I just, because I was just on basic, I'd done mm. a whole lot of time on basic. C used to have to come and C used to have to come and 
bring me my food and all that. And the screws used to, because it was so funny. He was actually chatting about it the other month, you mm. get me? And he was like, he was talking about it, innit? The screws used to try and take the piss. They used to be like, because they used to have something called Champ of the Day, innit? Yeah. Champ mm. of the Day, yeah. <laughs> and the screws used to always try and put my name on it. But that's no, what I was trying to, my was trying to bust, because every, what you have to, you have to wake up and do your bed pack, innit? Yeah. yeah. So by a certain time, like, you're supposed to be up. Bed made, everything. Mm. Every morning, they I'm in my bed. Mm. Like, I never used to make no bed pack, mm, you know, mm, like? Mm. So I used to miss souls. They used to put me as champ of the day every day. You get me? That's what he was trying to... You get me? He's like, I was just a mad you. You get me? I was a mad you. Champ of the day, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know. But I don't care. You yeah. get me? I don't care. Like, I'm not yeah. waking up. Yeah. Like, you know what I'm saying? They used to, like... They, they done that on mind games, innit? Yeah. Thinking that will make man not want to be champ of the day, innit? So now I wake up mm. and do my fucking bed pack the next day, but no, I'm still sleep. I'm sleeping. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? I just wake up for gym and that's it. Go gym. And that's it. That's all I cared about. Mm. Came out of the little chest and shoulders. That was me, mm. you know? Mm, mm, mm. But yeah. So how was it when you come out? Like, was you still doing that crime or...? When I come out that time. Because you're 18 now. What did you do anyway when your birthday, when you come out? What was that day like? Do well, you well the, the, the landing road overridden, it, innit? And it, mm. like, it was just, that was my euphoria that I'd landed road, innit? It's mm. the first time landing road. I didn't know the feeling. Mm. So that was good. Like, went, got my hair cut. I remember I got a train. From only, because I didn't actually tell any, I think I told my friends, a couple of my friends, but I don't think I told my mum, mm. you know, so that was a good surprise for me. Aww. So I went, got my hair cut, mm -hmm. went home, went to talk to your mum, bro, and then, so that, um, what happened, that, my cousin brought me on, um, my cousin showed me about um, shot in food and that. Because before, man, we shot weed and that, but man didn't really know about shotting food and that. Like, you know, like, crap. Mm. <laughs> yeah, you get what I'm saying? Man didn't know about that. But my cousin, like, his pops brought him on that early, in it. So he kind of showed me on my code. He was like, yeah, did it. Taught us, in it. Like, yeah, put it free. Da -da 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 -da. I had to do it. I remember we used to just walk up and down, walk up and down, licking shots, licking shots. And then from that, I got, like, a business mentality because it's like, we was getting money weekly, in it. It wasn't. It was different. Mm. Like, so then we just started doing that. And I just remember, we used to get like one. To, every time we spun, we used to get one. To, we were still kind of young, in it. Mm, like, mm, mm. And it was just, we was just making money. Yeah. Then I ended up going to jail. Six months later, I got remanded for um, for robbery again. Got remanded for robbery. That was unfortunate and. Because I was on licence, I got, um, yeah, that's why I got reminded. How did you get caught? I was in Woodhill. Huh? How did you get caught? I didn't get caught. Like, they just I went on um, ID parade okay. and I was picked. Mm. Um, yeah, I was picked on ID parade for something I didn't do. Mm -hmm. And then, um, yeah, so I got reminded. I went Woodhill. Mm. You know, big up for loot and man then. Man done you, Woodhill. We got um, Casper, got to make some good friends in there, Laney. Mm. Um, pick them up, pick them up. Yeah, so, man done Woodhill, and then I bust that case, mm -hmm. I bust that case, um, six months I got it acquitted, and it was nuts, because um, it was Cherie Blair, who was like Tony Blair's um, wife. Yeah. She acquitted that case in um, Luton County Court. I got that got acquitted like three days before my birthday as well. Really, two thousand yeah, July t July the twentieth, mm. two thousand. So I came home unexpectedly as well. Yeah, that day knocked knocked on my door, knocked on my mum. My sister just had a baby. I didn't see the baby yet in real life. Precious, you get me? Aww. So yeah, I just went back to selling drugs. Yeah. yeah, then I got nicked like six months later. Fucking hell. For um, 
intent to supply a class A. Mm. But I went back to jail. I had to take that still. I had to go guilty on that. That bird there. That's when I um, started doing music. Inside there, yeah? Yeah. How long did you get in that one? That one, I got another, um, I got two years because, like, basically, I, I said to that, I, was all, I, I said, look, I was under um, duress. Mm. There was a, a dread guy, he was making me do it. Mm. Blah, blah, blah. I read a letter to the charge, this, that, this, that. And I remember, I actually remember that time there, I read a letter to the judge, like, basically, you know, like, to him, look, like, I know I've got to go to prison, but, um, Please just give me like you know like a proper like good in my words in it, mm -hmm. so it's like I think the judge proper felt my pain yeah, mm. and he's come back and he give me some e that bird you know like a two and I because I was saying that thinking I'm gonna get a four in it, mm -hmm. where I'd already done the two or whatever so then he gave me two, and then it's like I started going mad like. But that guy mad, yeah, like you know. But the judge, he could see this ain't the guy. What's written? written what I'm thing. seeing in the letter, he could see. So then he tried to. He was told me to go back down. Then he, they was having bare like legal talk. Really? He was asking if he could change the sentence and all that. But he Don't lie. Yeah, no lie. You get me? But he couldn't do that. My mum was. My mum was. So he was in there doing gun fingers. I was going mad after when because I when I heard two, <laughs> I thought what? like it was like a bus case. Yeah. Like because. Like a bus case, but yeah. And he tried to change it back. You know? He's talking about Ross Clark. Mm. And they told him he had no grounds, but yeah. Yeah, you can't do it off of a reaction, in it. So boom, now done that. So that was that bird. That's when I started doing music. That bird was a bit nuts. That's when I went on tour. I went on tour that bird to a lot of different prisons. Mm. Starting with Chelmsford. Chelmsford. Who did I beat up in Chelmsford? Mr. Campbell. Not that Mr. Campbell, yeah. Big up Sil Junior. Sylvester. Big up Sharome. R.I.P. my nigga. R.I.P. You get me? That's where I bought Sharome. You get me? For real. Yeah. That's where I bought Sharome. And um, the maddest thing is our relationship started is because like, obviously after I punched up my man, Screws get onto you and whatnot, whatnot. And then, like, they're telling everyone to bang up, innit? Mm. Then I could hear them, like, you bang up, Blair, because he's like, all right, leave him now, because they're on me, innit? Mm. And he's like, leave him now, leave him now. And then they were just still, then I just see like, the next screw drop. I thought, wow. So he's got onto them, you get me? So they took us both down, block. You get me? So that was that pattern. But I had to get sentenced the next week, so I stayed there. They sent him Norwich. Sent him Norwich, and then after I got sentenced, I got sent Norwich. So I'm sitting, yo, shut up. You get me? That's where I bought Biscuit mm -hmm. and Shimmy. I and them mm -hmm. were there. Mm -hmm. You get me? Mm -hmm. Big up Shimmy, biscuit. big up Biscuit. Mm -hmm. You get me? So mm -hmm. we was in there. Them time there, it weren't like now, in it. Like it weren't like mixed. It was like very black. So I remember going there, and it was like racist. This guy got me into something decent. Sharon, man, RIP, but you're a madman, brother, man. You get me? So he got us into something decent there. Because, remember, we, we, he was talking or something. I mean, no, they were talking, I think, but he tried to tell them to shut up or something. You get me? He wants to go see. He's trying to... He's doing a lazy on them. He's, what lazy tried to do shut on up. me, he's done on them, but it's backfired because now they're too cool in the rubber lips. They're saying madness. <laughs> you get me? So he's getting mad in the cell, you know. Mm. My brother's getting mad in the cell, so he's... Saying, yeah, watch, we're going to move to them. He's telling me we're going to move to them in the morning. I can't believe this. You get what I'm saying? Remember, he ain't been sentenced yet, you know. I've took my <laughs> sentence, you get me? I'm trying to see our way out, but... Yeah. This guy's there, he's made two shifts, he's made me one, he's made himself one. So, it's that in the morning, isn't it? So, we've come out in the morning, boom. As we come out, but they've, they just started banging their self back up and all that. They got shook here. Yeah? Gone down, got a dinner. But I think we went upstairs, found one of them in the toilet, mashed him up in the showers. Yeah, we mashed up one of them. Then when we come back on the corridor, they're all at the bottom of the corridor with mops and that, but they're on dance hall. Mm. You get me? Mm. Boom, cut a long story short. 
they've ended up just not letting us out. The screws not letting us out. You get me? Mm. So they put us on twenty four um, lock, twenty four hour lockdown on in our cell. And I remember this guy, the madman. He's he's gone to the screw like yeah. I need some newspaper, I need some toilet paper. And then the screw come to give the toilet paper un- and he tried to put it underneath the door, innit? Mm-hmm. He's like, blood, I don't want to use this room. He's like, blood, you can't give me, I don't not use no toilet paper on the floor. Oh, bust yeah. the door. He bust the door. You get what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. As he bust the door, boom. Push past him. We're out again. We've matched up another one of them. You get what I'm saying? It was nuts still. So then they've shipped. They shipped him out. They shipped him out. Felt him. The next day, I remember the next day they've come, boom. Took him, felt him. No, I'm going mad. The next day he had caught. So he's gone, caught. Mm-hmm. And they ain't banging him back. He's gone, felt him, innit? Mm-hmm. Oh, kid, oh, fuck, whatever. Then the next morning they woke me up, boom. Shipped me out to felt him as well. Mm-hmm. You get me? But they put it in our flimsy that we can't be together, innit? So he was on Quail with, um, so he went Quail with Buckhead, R.I.P. Buckhead, man. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Buckhead and see him, like, he, he's gone either Quail or Partridge. I remember even Perry, you get me? All them lot, joke, hard jokes was in there. But I went Nightingale, and then, yeah, he stayed, he, he ended up going, <laughs> he ended up going Portland. <laughs> <That's the one laughs> <that>. <laughs> he ended up going Portland. Everybody talks about that one. So yeah. where was your worst one that you? Which one did you like dislike the most? It sent me from there when. Did um, you go Portland? No, because no. we couldn't be in the same jail. Okay. They had it in our oh yeah, 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 yeah. They had it in our flimsy. So they sent me back to Only, mm. and then I had a, I was in Only for a bit, and I had a madness in Only. Big up Sizzler. No, um, not even Jado Sizzler, Nick Sizzler, Kalanji, North Bessie as well. Really? Yeah. But um, I remember there, I was playing table tennis. One um, one youth from Tottenham, funnily enough, he's come on the wing, but he's trying to use the Tottenham kind of aura, whatever. He's moving like he's sat um, But I know Tottenham, man. I know Taylor. I know a couple of these in you. So I think he used this youth. But anyway. Must have lost in, in the table tennis in it, but then I threw on the ball back in, like you know, like to play again. But Reggie Razor, you get me strapped for the like Razor AC, yeah, boom. Anyway, so my man that's just coming, he's like telling me, yeah, he, he see me lose, it's his goal. I'm saying, but I'm just carrying on, cause I'm not even listening to what he's saying. The guy's dropped, he, the guy's just dropped his um, shower kit and like basically saying, come, like mm. you know, like so I can't miss. I'm Run over there, buy him with the um the table tennis bat. But Razor and um AC start punching him up as well. Cause that's how he used to move. I had a couple of man that's moving when man's they moving. Move, they move. Big up Razor, you get me an AC. So anyway, we whacked him up, but the screws have come in it. So the screws have come. As the screws come, I remember I've been twist up bare times. I'm not getting twist up again. I remember that. Oh fuck that. Remember, they got they got Razor, they got AC, and then I've come run past it. Kalanji, them lot was playing pool. Sis was past by the um, queue, and I've kind of backed them up. You get me? I said, I'm not going. Mm. I'm not going. Um, you're not twisting <laughs> me up. You get me? Mm. And it's like when if one's coming close, I'm swinging it so they can see. Like I'm actually on mm. licking one of you. And then I remember they got the gym screws because I used to love gym, and it's like Riv, what's going on? Blah blah. blah. Nah, man, I'm not, you know what I'm saying? I'm not doing this. So anyway, cut a long story short, they've let me go. They've let me walk to the block because I said, I'm not getting twisted up. You know what I'm saying? I'm not yeah. doing this, that again. You know, like, man, twisting you up and all that. They've let me walk to the block, innit? Then as I got to the block, they're telling me, yeah, put the pool, put the queue outside the cell. So I put the queue outside. Of, and I don't know what made me think I was going to get away with that yeah. sort of behaviour. Because everyone was like, I was oh, yeah, just saying, did they was just thinking, did they just not let you go? Listen, like, see, the middle of the night, they woke me up and battered me, yeah? Mm-hmm. And put me on emergency ship out. That's the first time I knew about emergency ship out. Like, mm. where you're just gone. Yeah. Right now, you're gone. You know, like, <laughs> yeah. I didn't know about, because I know about being in block, waiting for your ship out. So that one was emergency ship out. How much 
from one to one to ten, did you get the beat in what they gave you? Now they whacked me up. Whacked you up. They whacked me up still, but it was like whatever, because I just used to go into like it's like when you're having a tattoo and you're just in a different zone. That's how I used yeah. to go with them. <laughs> they never used to get me shouting or screaming or nothing. Yeah. Mm. So anyway, boom, emergency part. Got one screw on this side, one screw on that side. Boom, and I've went, guys must, and it was nuts, because I was thinking, guys must a good job. Mm. But basically, they've tried to use some different, they thought, oh, we're going to send you somewhere good and see if that helps, that makes you kind of pattern. So then I've gone there. Um, I think I told this story before, actually. Um, yeah. Ended up going mad on some screw, because he was trying to tell me to come off the phone. Mm. And then, um, yeah, so I went to duplication. And I think, yeah, I told that story. Them lot, I said to when when you, yeah, what does you think I'm going to get? It's like, nah, man, they should give you suspended. I said, oh, if they give me extra days, I'm going to move yeah, to the screw. Yeah, you're screwy. So you had to move to yeah, the screw. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? And then from yeah. there. That was funny, though. Yeah, <laughs> madness, you know what I'm saying? Like Dico, you didn't get to hear that one, but. Yeah, I'm like, he, that, he get me some ball. Move to the screw. Yeah, give me extra days. I've had to do what I'm saying, innit? What I said. Boom. So from there, I went stole Keith. And then, yeah, Stoke Keith was all right. That's where I moved to the governor. I told that story as well, I think. So when did you start writing your music? I'm going to let you know. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm saying. Getting there. Yeah, yeah. Got to flipping Stoke Keith, obviously. I swear I even said that forevermore. Stoke Keith, where I moved to the governor over the um, air freshness, remember? No, not really. I don't know if you maybe, said that maybe one. Maybe it must have... I said it on the neck that um, SP's really on SP's um, what, what? when SP um, interviewed me okay in yeah 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 that's when I said that one yeah that was yeah, screws just being dickheads in it like because um, I was gonna get I was looking big to get SP enhanced. as well huh I was just saying big up SP though yeah big up SP like yeah. so um, yeah like they come to do my um soul check because every every second week the governor used to come and check your soul in it mm. they wanted to stitch me up that week. So basically, you're only allowed two of each toiletries because something about bullying in it. So every time, just before that um, cell spin, cell search, cell search, when they check the cells or whatever, mm. I used to make sure I give people, like, give out like any extras to other people to hold or whatever. So I've had two um, air fresheners, but in it's the, in them it's the um, harpic, and in in one of thing they've got two. So I buy two of them. So they've come chatting shit because obviously they couldn't find nothing wrong with my soul. They said, oh, why have you got it? four air fresheners? Mm. I was like, what do you mean four? It's two packets. Mm. Cut a long story short. They're telling me they're going to have to put one in the bin. I said, you're not putting one in the bin. Like I paid, like my mum sends me money. Mm. She was like, oh, they tried to say it's only 50p or so. I said, it doesn't matter. I'm a pretty sports guy. I said, furthermore, okay, what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to put it in my box, in, in my, my property box, in reception. I know that's a long thing for them to do as well. So mm. if you're gonna, if you're not throwing it in the bin. Oh yeah, we're gonna throw it in the bin. All right, cool, do it then. Do you get what I'm saying? Do it, because now you're winding me up, and mm. this is what I do. You get so they've got me in that zone. He's gone to touch it. I've grabbed his hand. It's too late now. I've realised I've got to activate. Smack him to the face. He's smacked. You get me? I've got, I've got to activate. Yeah, he's smacked. Then they pull. I remember they pulled my legs from behind. I bust my face. Isn't it? Really? Yeah, I bust my face. I'm one block and then from there they sent me Stokey not not Stokey Doncaster mm. on a 28 day lay by and that's where I ended up punching up Mr. Ford and not Mr. Ford Mr. Um, him and his daughter man there's two of them um, I can't remember his name but it was him and his daughter mm. you get me that's another story <laughs> about the omelets okay, the yeah, got I, told it, I think I said it it's about the omelets when he was tried to, yeah, he tried to make me have bacon and I didn't want bacon. Did I tell that one? Yeah, you did. Remember? Yeah, 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 that, yeah, was, yeah, yeah. That, was, that was in that one. Yeah. Do you get what I'm saying? And that's when I started like doing gym. music mm -hmm. in Doncaster because they had the um, they had a studio there. But yeah, that's when I started doing music. So they had a music studio, mm. and then what? You just thought you go in there one day. Yeah. Well, initially I used to write like poems in it. Yeah. When I was down block and that, mm -hmm. I used to write poems. Um, did you write poems before that? Not really. I did as like a youth. Yeah. Slightly, but 
Mm. That's why I just was doing it again. Yeah. But then, like, I think someone sent me a beat. I think even maybe my brother. What was your sent poems me about? A tape of, of, I can't remember. Mm. Probably like it's madness. Though. I remember like seeing one of them and thinking, "Oh my gosh, like you was a lunatic." <laughs> so like it was actually just madness. I remember yeah, actually just finding like, one. And that's what I'm trying to think. Yeah, like what you were saying. Yeah, that was, was mad, like your was little. Mad, so you yeah, was using was your madness. poems as it like a little madness. release. Yeah, but it was madness. I remember seeing one. I thought, really you're off key. You, you know, like because it was just mad. I can't remember what it said, but like I'm on a train. Like it was just mad. Like you should put one of them I need in your to book. Find, if, yeah, if I find it. But yeah, so thanks. yeah, so you so you used to write poems, and then mm. I wonder why that person sent you a beat. Do you know who it was that sent you a beat? I Beat'd think it up. might be my, my brother. Is it was it? a tape of beats. What he just sent it to you? Yeah. And just is it? Yeah, I think it was my brother because he used to send me tapes. Does he know that was... um, he's the one that made you start writing slightly? I'm not sure. Oh, so okay then. So what? So you got the beat. So then I used to just kind of write to the beat now, innit? Mm. And then, yeah, from then. And then I remember, that's when I was down block. Um, when I was down block, because obviously after oh, Mr. Hodge, Mr. Hodge, the pussy old Mr. Hodge and Miss Hodge. And, his, and the daughter. That was their names. Yeah, yeah. And they try to give Trenton. <laughs> Smack to the face, <laughs> smack to the face, slap to the face. Don't no, be really joke, outside, got both of them at the same time. Oh, no, him first. Yeah, and um, then so what? She got involved. Slap to the face. Remember that's what we were talking about. Yeah, I know, SP, I know. But, but for those cut, that don't SP know, cut though, it out. remember SP cut, cut it out. Him. Yeah, remember he was saying he had to cut it out because man said, "Yeah, I slapped the, I slapped to slap the guy." Yeah, so then say, yeah. Huh? Yes, yeah, so he slapped them both in the face. Did, so yeah, did they, so no, what did they? I banged him and then I slapped her. But check out the um, ep- episode, SP, in it? Yeah, definitely, the link. Got yeah, story. come on. I need come on as well. Yeah, got that story in it. But um, so from there, and I was I was on a 28-day lay-by, so I had to be good mm. for 20, 28 days to be able to stay there, and I wasn't good. That was like 2002, New Year's Day. I'll never forget. That mm. was actually on New Year's Day. Mm. And I was like, yeah, that's when that happened. So then they sent me back to um, Stowe Keith, down block there. And then no other gels would take me. So they had to star me up and get me. I got starred up to Winston Green. But that time in block is when I wrote um, Getaway. That's when I wrote Getaway. That big tune there. Niggas want to know if young spray life is real. Listen, if you live my life, you kill. 16, they sent me right to jail. I know what it's like in hell. I've done years in jail traveling cells. You get what I'm saying? Like, because them time I was traveling cells, you get me? I know See, about yeah. 24 and none. Yeah, Locked down all day, before down before the block, it. never seeing the sun. Exercise time, never seeing it come. Supposed to get my hour out, never see it get done. You mm-hmm. get what I'm saying? But yeah, mm. that's when I wrote that. And um, Is that the first one you wrote, yeah? Yeah. So, so you wrote that one, and then... Is that the same... When you wrote it, is that the same jail that had the um, studio... No, it's when I got back. Like, I was going to the studio at them times when I was in Doncaster, but I think I wrote that. I wrote about a verse from I Can't Stop and I Won't Stop, mm. Fuck the World, and that chorus, but I done it on a different beat. Mm. You get me, Can't Stop, so I won't stop, Fuck the World. I'm going to hustle till I rush, Clark, reach my goal, so Fuck the door, Fuck jail and Fuck parole. Going to hustle till the demons come and take my soul. Can't stop, so I won't stop living my life. So all the niggas trying to do is feed his peace and wife down for whatever. If it's beef, I'm down for my brothers. I live and die for the for my crew until I'm under the covers. I remember I ripped that, mm-hmm. but to some different beat that man made. It was dead still. Some dead beat, but yeah, that. And then yeah, man got starred up. Then I just kind of didn't really care about music. I didn't write nothing else like that. For real? No, no, no. It's only like. When I came out that time, I think I've said this before as well. I was, um, one time, me and my big brother Taylor, we was, we was going somewhere, mm-hmm. and then I was like just spitting to my car. I remember the we going somewhere in my car, and the fucking the heating was fucked, like it was just and it was a cold day, and I was just driving, and I just started spitting, like you know that same getaway thing. Mm-hmm. He was like, who's that? Who's that? Who's that? I was like, it's me, man. 
like, hey, you're sick, you know, where am I used to carry your, carry your gold studio and mm. saying he's got a bridging called studio. I mean, <coughs> bridging called studio. He's got a bridging That's got a studio. studio. That was um, DJ Chris. He used to play on Deja at all times. Mm. But yeah, big up DJ Chris, Daddy Chris. Or yeah. DJ Chris or whatever. Big you up. Big him up. Because that was the first ever time I went studio. Mm. Yeah, you went to the she first get, ones. You know, like where you first on your proper mm, little, yeah, you get what I'm saying? Big up Stefan. Yeah, and I you went there. Producer. And I put down G. the getaway I. tune. I put down the getaway tune. And I put down... Me and Makazi, um, why's it gotta be this way? Get away. Yeah, that tune there, big tune. Mm. Why's it gotta be this way? Get away and the streets are kind of murky. Streets are kind of murky. Sorry, it was get away, the streets are kind of murky, and bad man from round here. Mm. That was the three tunes that I done. Bad man from round here, bad up man from round there. Gun man from round here, bun man from round there. <laughs> you <laughs> love that round yeah. there, really. <laughs> yeah, you get me. It yeah. was that. It was them three tracks. Scene. And then I came back to do the um. Why's he got to be this way? And I brought my cousin. Mm-hmm. You get me. Big mm-hmm. up Rods. You get me mm-hmm. to do the chorus. You get me. And that was that was that was the start of Young Spree. Mm-hmm. You know, because a lot of people they get they they. they they might think man started with North Star, but yeah. that was my initial when I started. You get what I'm saying? And then obviously I'd met C1 in jail. Yeah. Was he rapping from in jail? Was he rapping nah. before you? Oh, okay. No. Nah. I don't know him to oh. be a rapper. You get me? I know him to be a street nigga. Mm-hmm. But um, it's a boom now. I don't know if him and Taylor was reasonable. Me and him was, and I said to him, yeah, boom, man, do music. Because he was telling me. Him and Buckhead was doing this North Star team. Mm. They had a couple of artists, mm. China and Aaliyah White. Um, they had a couple of artists. So me and him reasoning. And then, like, obviously, he's heard man's thing. He's like, he, he had the faith in man, and it? Like, mm. no, nah, my man's sick, rare, rare, rare. So he kind of like telling me, look, we want to do this North Star thing, mm. rare, rare. But choose my bridging. Mm-hmm. And I didn't even really care about music, you know. Mm. Like that, but it's my bridging, and he like them time there is badness that I'm respected, mm. and them time they're on full time badness. You get me? Not, not you get me? Like that side of thing. It was like, cause I I always had my own little beef on my ends or whatever. Mm-hmm. So it was kind of a power move I done. Yeah, because I knew numbers, like. Isn't it? You, no, I had numbers. I no. had, I had numbers. I had some. Come but on, a, but a good look. I had numbers. You get me. But what it was is these lot was like it was like going from the first division to the Premier League of Badness. Same. If that makes sense, and I was the top striker in, in the first division anyway. Mm. But because I remember even when I started moving with them, like there was bare so 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 like oh, my man's gonna dare the road. What's he doing moving with them man now? Like no one had faith. <laughs> They never had faith in the. <laughs> 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 he nearly really made me spit my drink. Yeah, they never had faith. <laughs> they <laughs> thought he was definitely dead. That guy is dead. <laughs> that you is dead so fast. They thought, you get me, but they're not knowing I'm capable. <laughs> you get me? <laughs> I've proven my capability. <laughs> you get me? <laughs> Within a few years, I've proven my capability. You get what I'm saying? I've, uh, I'm even getting mad with it. I've taken it on me. I'm going, doing too much. Even, you get what I'm saying? I'm, they're red cards. You get what I'm saying? Too many red cards, but... Fun, we had fun, man. But that was the... Um, that was that. That was what kind of maybe went wrong with that situation. Because C was trying to bring me on a music team. Mm. And, you know, and he was really... He was, he was on it, you get what I'm saying? But I was more interested in the badness mm. for some reason. So that kind of maybe, that kind of flopped a bit, you know what I mean? Yeah, but we're going to get into a bit like, when did you do um, RTM Volume 1? Yeah, but do you know what it is? We're going to get into RTM Volume 1, but I have to say, North Star is a big part of this. So that, okay, cool. That, so that come before all of that, I can't just skip the whole Oh, no, 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 I'm not skipping it. I just, okay, cool. So, I can't right. skip that, you get what so I'm saying? Because that there, that was the movement that set the 
whole thing for because of our team for your man yeah scene. not like that but them man they kind of bust me on a bigger stage in it yeah do you understand yeah because even like obviously see before hey like big up magic and certain man like big enough, big enough. certain of the man them i wouldn't know if i didn't but the band them differently right you get me mark mm. lambs like some and them time lambs had name you get he still got name you get me big brother still got name and that you can, can never take that away from it but boom you get me man will still do some say nothing you get what i'm saying man was still come out for the big man but anyway so tiny know that you get me <laughs> now I'm, I'm going mad but man will still come out for the big man but boom so no star put me on a bigger stage in it mm. because obviously with the youngs playing them tracks there or whatever when i put them out obviously man on my ends knew i was about what i was talking mm-hmm, in it mm-hmm, mm-hmm. man i've had to run from man and man i've had to man the shots are fired and people are shot and they know my thing but boom now on a bigger scale they might have thought who's this you mm. what's he talking about you know what I'm saying? But it certified my thing coming from the camp I was coming from. Do you understand? Because yeah. who's really dropping things? Do you know who's really dropping albums? Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Albums was really um, dropping. Yeah. Do you get what I'm saying? Albums was really dropping. Sometimes all two at a time. Now I'm going mad. Mixed tapes and shit. Yeah. Everything was dropping. You get what I'm saying? So, and so, yeah, it made more sense. You know, plus, straight away, like, my old enemies had to fall back. Because it's like, come on, man, you can't, like, that's mad. You get me? That's like, I don't know, who's in the first division trying to come up against Liverpool? It's not going to, it's not sensible. Do you get what I'm saying? So, I kind of patterned all of that. So, like, yeah, it was good times, man. Mm. Get me? Best memories from that is like um, one time we had a show. We used to um, do a, a lot of shows, and that. we had a show in Greece one time. I think Lisa, um, big up Lisa, Lisa um, got us that booking, and it was so it was just so lovely. I just remember, but what it was, man used to take ease and that in it. Yeah, mm-hmm. I remember like I took dropped the ear, buzzing, was buzzing, and for some reason I thought this was the greatest. Greatest performance ever. Felt so like, <laughs> thought this was the greatest performance ever, mm. yeah? It just felt right. The yeah, sea, yeah. the horizon, everything. See, when we went back and looked at the thing, <laughs> like the next day, we couldn't believe what we were dealing with, but that was fun. <laughs> oh, total then, shambles. Mental, do you get what I'm saying? Shambles. Too. China's voice, mad. You get every, <laughs> Sorry, sis, but mad, everything mad. Got but China. boom now, we got China, man. Yeah. But um, and then we were supposed to, we, we was due to stay in Greece for another two days. Mm-hmm. Megs is four, man. A lot like Megs, you get me? Mega man, you get me? He's four, man. He's in Cannes, isn't he? Mm-hmm. He's saying Cannes is going to come true. We've fastened up our soul, innit? So we've left there, but we couldn't get a direct flight to Cannes. So we've had to come back to London. Mm-hmm. And then, so we've come back to London, but we have to stay in London. We had to stay, I think, Nearly a day before the flight to Cannes, so we've gone back to Lisa's. We've fallen asleep. Oh my god! We've woken up. We've missed the flight. We've fucked up. We've left early Greece. We're now just in England. Mental. You get me? That was a mad one. Mm-mm. And then next one. Where did we go? We went Kazakhstan. We had a performance in Kazakhstan, Mm-mm. and um, me and Wes had gone first, innit? But I think we booked it maybe, I think, nearly a day before. How long did it I take you to get there? Because it's done it for. Yeah, really? we, no, we're going mad. It's right next to Russia. But we got we got the, okay. first, we got the first plane to um, Russia, innit? Mm. And then we had, so we got the plane to Russia. And then we had a um, we had a plane from Russia to Kazakhstan. So we was waiting for these lot. But I think me and Wes got it way too early. So we was ended up in the airport for about 20 hours or so. I just remember mm. we was just having a madness in this 
airport waiting for these lot. But yeah, that was funny as well. Mm-mm. That was a good show. That's the best duck I've had as well in Kazakhstan. I always remember that. Really? Yeah. Yeah, you had some good, um, you had some good funny, funny memories with North Star still. You get me? So what happened with North Star? How come, how did it ca- that come to we an had, end? We put out Not Guilty Volume 1 and Not Guilty Volume 2. Remember, um, with that, with them CDs, like, we get it to all. Remember going press road and getting it yeah. all to all the man them. Yeah. Giving it to all the man them. It's sad. I remember either, like, to, I remember Zags, he used to tell me that, um, Zags is, it's funny because Zags told me that Sparks bust me over there. Sparks, R.I.P. Sparks. Mm-hmm. If anything, him and Boogie bust my thing in like ghetto. He's like, yeah, this you young spray, the street's kind of murky. Mm-hmm. Street's kind of murky. You get what I'm saying? So it's the man, them, the rude boys on the road that bust man. You get what I'm saying? The girl, them bust man too, because we was like face man, innit? Mm-hmm. Like, mm-hmm. me and C, like, Obviously, when I was younger, a female following yeah. Well. Obviously, when I was younger, I was ill, in it. You get what I'm saying? That's how I got the girl Haley. You get what I'm saying? Car. Big up Haley. Whatever. You Come get on. what I'm saying? We're not even on that right yeah, now. Yeah, but I'm a big girl, please. Thank you. I'm just saying, them time you hit me, boom, face, boom. So, yeah. So, um, yeah, the girl embarrass us as well because the girl used to be like, oh, which one's your favorite? Which one do you like? Yeah. You get what I'm trying to say? But that's always good to have girl following and guy following, though, isn't it? Why for that? <laughs> Why for that? I don't no, know about you know no guy following. But you know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, I don't you know about no the, guy following, but it's good to have girl and following. all of them was telling the people them about you and whatever, Yeah, it's good whatever. to have girl... Yeah. Do you get me? Yeah. So, yeah, mm. your thing was basically you're saying everything was saying. Hood, yeah, the hood thing. You get what I'm saying? The hood certified the, the thing. Hood, you get you me? Got, the hood certified the hood love thing. as well. Do you know what I mean? Do you know what I mean? So it was good times, man. It was good times. I remember doing up Napa. Mm. All the times so we went Napa. So proper done like touring and everything then. Basically, not you lot got, a, but you lot still got, a, but you got about though for them yeah, times yeah, there. Yeah, do you know what I mean? Definitely, you lot was man. doing stuff. Do you get definitely, me? Definitely, man. They know about us, man. Yeah. And you know, it just ended up being like a name. They thought we was a gang, but really we weren't a gang. It was just that was the name of the group, mm. which was me, C One China, and Aaliyah White initially. You okay. Know, it's funny when I used to hear like, oh yeah, Master and a beef in North Star. I think we're right, they beef in China as well. Mm, mm. Uh, we're just a group, you know. Mm. We're just a group. You get me with all gal and yeah. You get me. The man them now. You get me some sharp man thing. You get me. She want to talk about gang now. I'm joking. You get me some <laughs> real sharp man, but yeah, no, it was good times, man. Did you kind of stop doing that then? And then like kind of branch off on your own and do your mixtape and that? Kind of. that The thing that, because you know what it is, they were fighting against the thing. Mm. Like there was different points of views as well because obviously like C would listen to them sometimes talking their rubbish. And they used to be like, oh, you need to come, you need to do this, you need to do that. You know, I got his vision, but... I didn't necessarily believe in it because mm. his vision was more. Cause we made good tunes, don't get it twisted, good commercial tunes, but that wasn't really where my head was at. My head was more at seeing the not guilty CDs and all that. Yeah, where we're talking madness. That's yeah. was my even bigger oats. OG OG was on what I was on. We're thinking more that way. Mm-hmm. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. So, but she's more thinking the glossy way in it, mm-hmm. like the f- you know what I mean. And no matter what we're doing, what they're telling us to say, so what is, and they just weren't letting us go through. She got to a point where um, I think China got pregnant, or she started doing other stuff as well. Mm-hmm. You know, and bear in mind they're putting in money in this thing, in it. Yeah, she's putting in money. Lisa's putting in money. At some point, you're gonna look at it and think. If Money is not coming back in. We're not gonna just keep putting money in something. That's, do you get what I'm saying? Mm. So that kind of panned out. So then it got to a point where, what do I do then? Mm. Do I just go back to the road and just get on with it, or do I um like what do I do in it? Yeah. 
And by that time, by that though, San just said, found the footage, bro. My bad, mad man. Big you up though, son. <laughs> but, yeah, yeah. So boom now. By that time, I've like experienced the music game, innit? Like I've been, like I said, we've done little things. When I'm going on the road, everyone's noticing me. Like I'm, I'm like a digger D. Mm. <laughs> Them t- like mm. yeah, digger mm. D is. That's how I am. You get mm. what I'm saying? Mm. They're hating my thing. You get what I'm saying? They, when they see me, but the difference is, I'm fucking, fucking, yeah. But anyway, boom, I'm going mad. To fight. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> they're hating my thing. So yeah. I'm kind of smelling it. I'm not gonna lie, so yeah. I don't, I don't want it to end, in it. Mm. So I think, oh, you know what? I'm gonna carry on. Now. Yeah, I'm just gonna carry on. You get me? And plus, it's like the only thing that I can say that I do. Yeah. You know, like when they say, "What do you do?" I can't say, "Well, I sell drugs." Like, do you know what I mean? It's not. So it was something that I had that I could say that I do, mm. and I really like that. So that's when I started doing RTM Volume One. Big up One Step, man. Big up Lion. Mm. You know, Lion and Free, f- big up Free Finger, um, and Free You as well. That's my brother. Mm. Cause Free Finger gave me the link to um, One Step and Lion. He's, he's like a brother, but we we literally made some hits in that One Step's yard in um in Peckham, Queens yeah. Road. Yeah, Queens Road. That's where it all. That's where it all. You know, the Young Spray kind of wave started. Read of the most one we done that whole CD and read of the most two in then Queens Road, Peckham. Mm. You know what I mean? I made read of the most one and two in Pecky when the rose was techy. <laughs> What's your respect? <laughs> you get what I'm saying? Big up face this but yeah. So yeah, no nah, man, it was good any times. Good, any any good um like good stories or anything from studio days, then time there when you was doing RTM Volume One. Um. Couple funny ones, but I don't want to hot man up. Mm. But man, no, you get me one mm. step, you know, you get me. I'm a maniac, you get what I'm saying? You get me? Because man, what man know as well. But one time, man, try You get me, man, give me a jaw, and I didn't think the jaw was big enough. And you get me? Kind of quit on a man still, but Mm-mm. you get me? But no, nah, man, it was all love, you get me? Mm. It was all love, it was all just. This was, it was early times in the dream, you get me, where man's actually still thinking man can make it in this thing and, you know, it was good, it was good days, but man. But that, when that uh, mixtape, when you put out that first mixtape though, mm. and you saw the response and how well it done, mm. do you get what I'm saying? Like, good mm. mixtape, up to now people still telling, bigging you up about it, innit? Yep, really the up most funny now. one was groundbreaking, man. It was groundbreaking and ruthless records. I can't wait till we get ruthless to sit on his mm. chair. Mm. Ruthless can best describe it. Yeah. Because he got to sell it. Yeah. And he used to sell it in Wembley Mark. He used to. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. And yeah. Big up ruthless. Big up ruthless. Yeah. So he'd more be able to describe, describe the how impact it, that he had on the streets had, and in jail. I didn't get. No, nah, I could tell you. I, I, no, I but I'm just in, saying. I'm saying I, places. I could tell you about the bin. On both, get me do you know car. what I mean? I've gone to the back yeah. to the bin since then and seen. Mm. You know, mm. and you know what I mean. So, but the influence where it was that CD, we did the most one where I had my top off, I was smoking my weed, I had the glasses, the shades, and mm. no one ain't done that as visuals out there, like rude way. Mm. Them visuals, their chests and tattoos, and mm. you get what I'm saying. It wasn't that was it was just mm. the visuals was mad. He would mm. he would tell you Rufus would come and tell you blood. Gal was coming and buying that. Mm. That don't even care about the music. It's mm. like the cover, the cover. Mm. Mm. You get what I'm saying? So it was that sort of vibe, you know. And it was groundbreaking. But you know what came and kind of pa- see really the most one. There's not a lot of CDs that I could say that I could talk to that. The one CD that I know that came and spoke to that was Hard Body. <laughs> Do you get what I'm trying to say? Because mm. Hard Body, I can't style how Hard Body. Mm. I can't style that. Mm-mm. That came in and mm. that was mad. Do you get what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. That was mad. Crazy. That was mad. Do you get what I'm saying? So yeah. yeah. I'll on. give him his props for that. You get me? You have to. So, yeah.
Yeah. What's What's your favorite um tune off the mixtape? Your mixtape. Um, it's gonna have to be "Mummy Don't Cry," just mm. on the strength of just the subject matter and mm -hmm. you know what I mean. Mm. That first, one, but get away as well, because you know just the history. That's the first tune I wrote, and you know, but a lot of them tunes from "Real of the Most Volume One." Um, yeah, but "Real of the Most Volume Two is a big CD as well. In the reason "Real of the Most Two is such a big CD is because the pressure I was put under by Hard Body. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Because before Hard Body, like everything, it was kind of going to my head a mm. bit. Because I just felt like no one could chat to me, like in this music. Like, everyone would like I didn't rate no one. Like, do you get what I'm saying? I thought I was so good. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm. even lyrically, I knew I was better than um, Kicks. But he had things that I didn't have. He mm. had, like, flow. His voice was mm. fucking amazing. Yeah. Like, his fucking ad libs was fucking mm. amazing. Crazy. Yeah. Yeah. Literally. So, and that, I hadn't, I hadn't um, mastered that yet. Yeah. I didn't know about that. You know what I'm saying? Mm. That's the f he's the first person I know to come through and master that. You know? So, yeah. That's why I really most too was so good. Like, you know, bury me a G and a couple little tick there. There were some rhythms on there. Still, I can stand on my own feet. I'm a man of bust my own eat. Like, mm. born alone, die alone. Nobody can own me. Like, I'm a G all by my lonely. It's like, mm. mad still. Any favourite collabs? Favourite collabs? Yeah. I didn't use to collab them times. No, you didn't work with nobody. Was there anyone no. that you wanted to work with? I, the only collabs I do is like in-house. Like I collabed with... Um, really the most volume one had zero collabs. Mm -hmm. Tell her like it had one, two collabs. One with my cousin mm -hmm. and one with China. Right. But it had no output, no output. Oh, 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 okay. Volume, volume, two had, volume two had collabs with Romain, my brother. I mean, mm -hmm. OG in the camp, Oats, um, Tyus, my nigga from Brixton. You get me? That's my family. Ibs, Swift One, ruth ruthless um, brother. Mm. Big up Swift One, Ibs. We still chat today. It was all family. But if we're going on longevity, like all in all, mm. my um, favorite collab will have to be Skepta. Yeah, it's gonna have to be Skepta because. That was the most successful collab, mm. you know, and he come out for me and he come and give man a strength at a time he didn't have to, mm -hmm. and it was just good. It was that it was good memories. Even when I look at the um, the video we done, just the the um, headspace I was in at the time, I had good management. We got Colin, mm -hmm. we got Colin. I had good management at the time that believed in me. But obviously, he, he found out that um, there was a lot against me, and he got he got to find that out as well. But um, you know, you see Jeremy in the video, Meridian Dan, mm. Bossman Birdie, big up Birdie, big up Pabs. You know, like we was just having a good time. Um, it was like, it was um, Fuse, we was just having a good time. Mm. Um, Chip was in that video. Fecky, get me Fecky, come to you, give man the strength. Um, yeah, it was just yeah. I liked I liked that video. Mm. Yeah. That sounds like a little good, little good era, little good time in your music career. Do you know what? It was all good times still. Yeah, it was all good times. It, yeah, you get me. But that was just at a time where um I'd level the lev It was a level up in it because mm. with Colin, what I will say, Colin, because he's been in the game so differently like he knew how to do things like on a proper professional level yeah that i hadn't experienced before mm -hmm. like that album invisible tears like that was that was in hmv that i didn't experience that sort of thing in it yeah. even like got man a deal like mm. they even know about all of that you know what i mean so yeah big up call man yeah definitely so what happened with your deal how did that happen what happened with that um I think that was just an album deal mm -hmm. with Invisible Tears. Mm -hmm. I had a single deal with um, Lily Allen. That was for that show track. Really? Yeah. 
Pick she, up Lily Allen. Yeah, big up Lil, big up Lily, man. Yeah. Um, she had a um, she had her own, she had her own um label through Warner, mm-hmm. called Bank Holiday Records. Mm-hmm. Basically, they've heard they'd heard the tune, um, and she liked the tune. So yeah, they um they signed it. So I've got yeah, got a little money and all that. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Mm. So yeah, big up Lil's man. But um yeah. So, something I can say I've got sad. <laughs> you, know you get me? Yeah, yeah. go on. Um, what was your favourite memories like in that time? All together. Or mm. All together. And you was doing your music at that time. I'm talking around when you got signed, you know, and all of that. Be like, any most memorable moments? Mm. Um, Devlin bring me out. Devlin bring me out at Norwich, that was all right. Yeah? Yeah, big up Devs. Um, just, um, oh yeah, um, Dan's, Dan had some go karting thing for the, um, when he done that German whip tune. Mm-hmm. He had some like go karting event, that was, that was a good memory. Yeah? Yeah, that was fun still. That was fun. Mm. You get me? Yes. Yeah, so Just all so the video shoots, really. Yeah, all the video shoots and everything. So then, so after all of that, what happened? What did you start doing after that? Like after your album, after the album deal, what happened? I was just still making music. Yeah, so they didn't re-sign you. Just kept doing your thing. No, because it was just a, um, it was just a one it was it one album. It wasn't like two albums. It wasn't two. Singles. Was Colin still managing you after this? After Invisible Tears, mm. Colin fucked off. Did yeah. he after the deal? <laughs> <laughs> Colin fucked off. Don't make me laugh. Colin said, "I'm out." You know, Colin thought you didn't recoup. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you did it really cool. He said, I'm out. You get me? For real. But we still chat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I think he just had enough, innit? Because mm. well. he was just, and it worked out for him. Because, mm. you know I mean? I think he's doing, he was doing an H, he didn't even H, um, Digga D, you know. He just needed to offload me. <laughs> mm. I come with a lot of other stuff that he realised. You get me? Because they're now. Whoever's around me is gonna get that fight. Mm. Do you get what I'm trying to say? And I think he he, um, he saved himself for the right time. Mm. You get me? Mm. But yeah, mm. like Cole fucked off, man. Cole, Cole went loyal. Coffee boy, you get me? Yeah, I'm, like, I'm joking, Cole, but <laughs> Mike. Yeah, Mike went mad. Cole, I told Mike him I paid Mike for that. Don't worry, I paid him for that. I didn't. Didn't rate that you get me, uncle. Mm-mm. Pays him for that, but yeah. yeah. So now you're just out here doing your music and just still doing it and whatever. Yeah. So from that, I was just doing. Yeah, I was just doing music. I put out a couple of, like. What did I put out? What did I? Invisible tears. When did you do all your like your daily duppies and your freestyles and all of them ones? I've done them all like just throughout. Well, Talk back. And but any any favorites? The um, what's it called? The okay. Fire in the booth. I done with I Records. Mm. I didn't do that with Cole. That was a big one. Mm. So um, I'm not sure when I done. I think maybe I done the um, the behind bars. I might have done with I Records. I can't remember the times. I think your um, your Adele one is the one that I remember. That's I really Fire in the booth. Was that the Fire in the yeah. booth? I think that one was lit. The home on the hometown rhythm. Mm-mm-mm, that's trying to be. Yeah, yeah. I think that one was lit. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, I've done a good few um freestyles. I like the even the um big up mixtape madness. Mm-hmm. Cause that one, that one's kind of underrated. I like that one. Uh, Mad about bars. Mm-hmm. Um, the daily duppies. It's mad because the other day was my birthday and Black King must have done a um. Kind of collage of bare different tracks. For real. Yeah. Big up, Black King. Big up, Black King. Big up, Black 
Kings UK. But yeah, they done a little collage and I thought, yeah, it was hard. And then, but I could have done one with a different one. Mm. With so much different tracks in it. And I thought, mm. right, you know what? Made me actually rate myself. Like, I mean, you've got, you got, you got some. Like even when I sent you that, them track, you're like, I didn't even know you've done a track. Yeah, with yeah. Oh. Every time you always say, even like with the guests, sometimes you might send me and I realise you've got a chill. I'm looking and there's something else. Do you get me? Mm. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. But mine was literally just doing a lot of music. Mm. And all of the platforms and everything, like, they was all, like, really rating your thing. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah they had to. everywhere. Do you get me? Yeah, they used to run, they used to run man down. Huh? They used to run man down still. Yeah. yeah. Like, you was at, you know, you was one of the, one of the, still are one of the legends, but, you know, like, going places. So I want to get, like, into the GRM thing. What, what GRM thing? The Lady Duppy. I want to get into the incident that happened. What incident? There was an incident that happened with you. What incident, though? When you got stabbed. Fucking yeah. Man. Yes. You mean right. the rated awards? No, yeah. I'm joking. I know yeah, yeah, I know what you know. I know. <laughs> yeah, what about it? So, like, um, what was you? What tunes was you doing at that time? What tunes? Mm. Nah, you're treading you softly. You? What are you talking about? What? Just get into what you need to no, get No, 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 so I'm just trying to, on. like, time spread, like, just after you've done your... get into what you need to get into so we can move on, what tunes, like, what do you mean? What tunes was I doing them? No, for? like, when you was doing the rated awards, like, what you do? Was I wasn't you there, for, they didn't invite me to do nothing, I wasn't getting on stage. No, I know, but was you, like, you know, obviously, before then, they were still fucking with you heavy and stuff like that, yeah, do you get what I'm saying? I forget all of that, I can't remember all of that, you no. get me? Are we gonna, do you, what do you want to know about this event? Yeah, right, so, so, after all of that... So when that happened, and then the platform stopped fucking with you and everything, I want to get into, like, your mindset. All right, do you want to hear about the event? Because this is probably what they want to hear about. Well, tell Skip us a little them. bit whatever you want to tell Skip us. It. I could say whatever I want. Well, go on, then. Because of, like, everyone's out here. Yeah, I know. Yeah, 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 say, say what, what you want to say. Yeah, yeah, I'm that's asking what I'm you saying my you're questions. going around it. I'm going around the questions I want to ask. Yeah, Just, but yeah. I'm saying you're going around it, So Cream. the rated like, awards is rated... Ask, what people want to know, yeah, it? but I want to get around, right. I want to get leading up to it first. So, obviously, get at the rated that. awards, That's what I'm no one cares about okay, cool. Leading up to it and but what we're talking about your stuff, yeah, I know, but I'm saying no one cares about that. I'm going to tell you what they want to know. That's not the yeah. only thing they want to know about. I'm telling you what they want to know, yeah, because I've obviously, I've we've all heard the rumors, mm. all of this. Like, mm. I was supposed to have got onto Buck and batted that Buck, and then whoa, 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 didn't go like that. Boom. Okay, cool. I've gone there. I've got. I've been invited. Furthermore, well, um, I had a me plus one to go there. Yeah, that's what I mean. From Posty, forget all of that. Mm. From Posty, mm. and then I've gone there with a man. You get me? A man that's everywhere with them now. But <laughs> I've gone there with a man. Boom. I've gone in there. Took zero search as well. Mm. So that was like dance or anything. Gone in there, whatever, seen a couple of people. I see eight, see a couple of man having my little drink. I see Skepta and all that. We got Skeps. Um, I think I went backstage and that's what I did see Buck. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I saw Buck. And um, so I was chatting to him because like previously there'd been a little incident or whatever at the O2. Before that, mm. so and I hadn't seen man since then, mm -hmm. so it's like I've seen him, and so I was like, Oh, yeah, you know, like you can see I'm just here on my music thing, boom, 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 boom. like basically letting him know. And you know, this buck, you get what I'm saying, car. Obviously, if I was gonna bad you out, I'd have bad you out, I'd have punch you up, I'd have smashed your face in, but I didn't. You get what I'm saying? It wasn't even that sort of argument, you get what I'm saying? Mm. No, we're near my level, so if I wanted to do it. Could have done it. It wasn't that sort of argument. So, mm -hmm. Yeah. So I just so said, you're there on that. Listen, listen, mode. listen, please. Yeah. So boom. So I've saying to him, Oh yeah, you know, it's just on the music thing. I'm just here, blah, 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 blah. We're chatting, whatever. But I think I might even be a bit tipsy or whatever. I don't know, innit? But I'm saying it's cool, innit? Just make the man they know it's cool, it's calm, whatever. You support Liverpool anyway. Mm. He supports Liverpool, innit? So Patterning with him, innit? Like, you know, you support Liverpool anyway, so kind of laughing, whatever, whatever. But what it is, sometimes I don't realise, yeah? Remember, that's what that's what I'm putting across to him, innit? For 
him, he might be taking it. Because I don't know if he must be, if he's a nerve, like, a nervous wreck, in it? I don't know. But I just don't know how it got to that, to hearing the rumours of, I put it on Buck, because that never happened. And even Buck's admitted that it never happened, because I spoke to Foss after. Um, yeah, I spoke to Foss after. So I don't know where that came from, but no, I didn't put it on Buck. Mm. Um, yeah, so that was that. So I don't know if he's gone and he's oh, so spray and where I don't know, mm-hmm. but just after that, boom, I was in the um, I was in the um, change rooms, um, yeah, um, I think Skepta in that dressing room, and then the doors being rushed. Obviously, I said to the feds, it was just bad, like white people rusting or whatever, mm-hmm. boom, and then. People just rushed me or whatever, got stabbed mm. and what not, what not, yeah. So that was that. And then there was a video going around of me and my claret and all that. Mm. And it was like, everyone was like, oh, why is he on his own? Why is he on his own? The person that I'd gone with said that they'd gone to get security. So I don't know what that was about. But yeah, that's what they said to me. But um, mm. yeah, so... But, um, yeah, woke up in hospital, made it through again, you know what I'm saying, like, oh, I had to kill again, do you know what I mean? And then, mm. obviously, I posted a picture, because mm. I was just seeing beer, R.I.P., R.I.P., R.I.P. And, like, even my friends, it was like, don't go on, don't go on, um, they were telling me, don't go on the internet. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Obviously, they probably, they seen the video, in it? So it was like, don't go on the internet, da, 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 da. So, yeah. Went on there, see it, posted my picture. Um, yeah, and that. And then, like, people was trying to get, people was getting my numbers. And that's what I'm saying. People don't realise sometimes, like, what it looks like on the outside, it's not really that. Mm-hmm. Do you get what I'm saying? People yeah. get phoning me. You know, I had people phoning me, telling me it's nothing to do. It wasn't them. It wasn't their brother, blah, blah, blah. I've had, do you get what I'm saying? This is what I've had, didn't it? Like, I've gone through all of that. People saying they were going to pay, man. <laughs> all this stuff, do you get what I'm saying? It was in a pay man. But then I went mad on Twitter. Do you get what I'm saying? Because I heard people went to some Steph London party. And people, what people don't realise is throughout all of this, I'm on my back and I'm definitely got mental health. Mm. Do you get what I'm trying to say? So mm. I'm not even thinking straight. So, and even when I was going mad on Twitter and all that, and then you had mm. people like, ah, oh, so you're dry snitching. And I was thinking, what the fuck are you lot talking about? Mm. You know, like people that don't know crime. Mm. I'm thinking I'm the one person that can send every like it's up to me. Do you get what I'm saying? Whether mm-hmm. I say what I say, do you get what I'm saying? Like, mm. so how can I be dry snitching? It's either I snitch or I don't. There's no in between. Do you get what I'm trying to say? So anyway, mm. so after I kind of done all of that shit, communication went out the window because really, there was communication with. You get me? There was actually communication. So, and you know what I mean. I was supposed to get our money, you get what I'm saying? <laughs> mm. But, you get what I'm saying? I, f- I flopped the money, I flopped the bag, you get what I'm saying? I've gone so crazy on Twitter, I've missed that on the bag. But mm. they, you get what I'm saying? They must have had faith that I'm not going to open up my mouth, so, you get what I'm saying? But anyway, yeah. you know what I mean? And that was that, really. And then, from there, I was making a diss to you like every day, mm. for a set more mental health, you get me done a talk in the hardest remix. It's all on this channel. <laughs> all the tunes is still on this channel. Yeah. Check them out. You get what I'm saying? If you if you got time, you get what I'm saying? You can see. How, you get what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm going to go see. into what was your mindset after, but we Crazy. all know what the you mindset get what I'm saying? was. I was then, and yeah. you get what I'm, even that was mad because it's like, and that was frustration as well because mm. realistically, like I know, in it? Like mm. rude birding, I know what I'm supposed to be doing, but then... It, there was a lot that, mm-hmm. um, you know what I'm saying? Because it's like, for me to be doing that, I got I got my um, child I got to think about. Exactly. I got fucking Hayley talking, whatever she's talking. Oh, you need to let the, you need to let it go. Mm. Let it go. So it's like, oh, bear, big up, big up your game, mum. Bear things, man. Don't big up, because she's let it go as well. <laughs> but I... Fuck that. Anyway, so boom. I'm going through shit. You know what I'm saying? Mm. If I had to go through shit. Because even really, I'm knowing to myself, on rude by a thing, 
That's why when I said, like, I remember I get people all now, like, oh, you ain't done nothing. I mm, get mm, it because mm, mm. I'm off the streets. Do you get what I'm trying to say? So none of that hurts me because I get it because I am supposed to. Do you get what I'm saying? As far as the streets is concerned, I am supposed I'm supposed to be sitting down doing 30 years, but that's what you'd, you'd and then who's looking after my youth? Who's looking? Do you get what I'm trying to say? So I had to come to that kind of mm -hmm. decision, innit? Mm. Like, you know what? And with everything else as well, I got to see things for what they really are. Because a lot of people that I thought would have stood up straight or stood up firm for man and whatever, it didn't really go that way. So then... Because that's what I'm trying to say at first. Everyone was nervous. Don't get it twisted. Everyone was nervous, like I said. No one's phoning me. But then, obviously, no one ain't stupid. When they clock, like, hold on. Man, I actually listening to what, to this madness we're saying. Man, I actually, cause man ain't even supposed to listen to no one say nothing. Like, what you mean, this spray? Because I came out of there, the bad guy, I swear that. Like, oh, it's spray, he done this, or he done, didn't you hear the rumours? I moved it, or I moved the buck, or rare. It. it was me. It was my fault. Mm. But... I think it was amazing to people that that was even accepted. Mm. So from there, obviously, man's going to take it on and just work with it, innit? Mm. Because why not? Do you get what I'm saying? And it was a power move as well. Everyone's trying to impress Drake, innit? Because a couple months before that, I'd run up on that one OVO um, dance, innit? Mm. I'd run up on one dance. And obviously, but I was looking for a man, innit? Nothing to do with them. They knew that. You get me? The guy worked there, but obviously Drake's people was there. Jolly Rocks, yeah, he, you're sweating, you remember? But he was cool, do you get what I'm trying to say? So man's chat to them, whatever, whatever. But what it was is they saw like, rah, where's all these? So they saw there was a different firm. So it was got a bit complicated because now they're like, who's this spray guy? Da, 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 da. Because me and um, my man even spoke, you get me? Mm. And we ironed it out because I was saying, yeah, so he knew, innit? And that was what led up to the old two thing because man tried to ask me, yeah, yeah da, da, da. And I was thinking, but we've already spoke about that. Mm. Don't like why are you trying to bring it up? So I still didn't clock that man was trying to do a make a power move, you know, like man was just trying to show these people like impress Americans basically. But I get it as well now because you're protecting the bag and it worked, didn't it? Cause look where <laughs> you get it worked. So do you know what I mean? And that's what that was. Mm. You know, it was like kind of showing them like look, because it's like from you can do that to that guy. Because they witnessed what I done that day and how... So from you could do that to man and nothing ain't really reached back because it was supposed to be World War Three, And nothing ain't really reached back. So you're heavy. You lot are heavy then. Do you get what I'm trying to say? And that's what it looked like. Do you know what I mean? And remember, they don't know anybody else. They don't know there's beer utes in, in Junction. They don't know there's beer utes. They don't know there's utes in beer utes. In, like, they just know these utes. In the industry, guide to these industry dudes with their numbers and acting like however they acted. They don't know there's beer of a man mm. from air that's thinking they're beat. The beer man in Brum, there's beer man in Manchester. There's, this is not just these guys. Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? But it's looking like, rah, they're the guys, isn't it? So it worked, you know? And um, yeah, and that, that was that, really. Mm. Do you know what I mean? That was that. And, um, yeah, I was just making a diss track every day for a set. Then I had to loud that, you get me? Yeah. Because I realised that was going mad. Then I, um, I started the RTM Records Label. thing. You get me? Where man got some good artists and that kind of helped me get through it. Yeah. As well. Um, yeah. And then tricked So what made you think to do it. that? Huh? What made you think to do that? What, RTM Records? Mm -hmm. Um I can't remember. I really can't remember. But I remember the first person I got was that... Um, Joel Mitchell. Joel Mitchell. Yeah. You get me? From Nottingham. And he was hard. Yeah, he so, was, not it? Yeah. And then it started with that. And then I done the fumes, the engineer thing, and we were at... We were, so it started with that. Got a couple of eyes, some ice cream gal. Come on. You get me? Come on, don't she try to skip hard, over me. me. Yeah, she, she was... Hard. Hard, isn't it? Yeah. Come on. Yeah. She was the hardest still, but <laughs> yeah. You was um had um unsigned, big up unsigned, big up, unsigned, big big up, up cause, up. big up yeah. fav, big up CO, Max. big up Max. Um, yeah. who am I forgetting? Mike C. Um, 
Busy, right. busy, big up, busy, big up. Who else? I don't want to forget nobody. See one, Gav, see, I got, yeah, Gav, oh, Come on, coming to Gav. Big up Gav, free yeah, fucking Gav, Gav, Gav as well, you know. Free you up in our bro. Gav misses free me today. Gav. He sent me something to do still. Yeah. He sent me something to do. Gav's too yeah, hard, you know. Boy, bad boy, yeah. He sent me something today off the blue phone. <laughs> no, I'm joking. I'm pissed. I never get my feature off Gav, you know. You have to send me something. Yeah, no, nah, man. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, so doing up RTM, RTM records. Yeah, no, nah. check him out, man. He put some special GAV special dungeon exclusive. Check that on Spotify. Oh. Yeah, he said, gave you a massive shout out, bro. And so did the dungeon. I ain't even listened to it yet, but free Gav, man. Oh. You get me? Free Gav. Times a million. But yeah, so that was that. And it's like, so yes, I had to get over it as well. Even though, like, people still hear me mention a man's name and I say whatever I say, and man's like, oh, spray, spray, which I get it as well. I need to just stop in it, but it's a big deal what happened to me in it. It was yeah. so no one can't tell me. It's like when me and Stanley were saying when people try to say, oh, you need to get over your mom dying. No, no. I get over when I want to get over it, yeah. and no one ain't be like I'm a very special you in it. Like I know this, yeah. Mm. A lot of people couldn't have went through what I went through. Mm. And then you just get over it. How? Mm. Do you get what I'm trying to say? How are you supposed to? It mm. would be easy for me to get over to it. If, if I grew up as a dickhead or a chief, but it's not. I have to fight my demons daily, continuously. Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? It's on a top, continuous on top of fight. It, certain, something you happened saying? to you and certain people in the industry turned their back on you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So that's why, that's even, I to deal even with though well. I was going around it, but I also wanted to mm. clarify the fact that I know that that comes secondary, but you was also an artist. Mm. Do you understand what I'm saying? Mm. You got an invite to the awards. Mm. Do you get what I mean? Mm. So, you know, they you was there on music stuff. You're somebody that was recognised as well. Mm. And after that, there was no, you know what I mean? Like, we're sorry about what happened or or nothing to do with your, or some, or with you or posting your stuff or every, or anything. Yeah. It's like you're getting blackboard for something happening to you. Do yeah. you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, we didn't even get... That's what I wanted to touch into. Do you understand what I'm saying? Mm. I get that get as me? well. I get that as well, because all these people, like, truth be told... No, but nowadays, wait, wait, that doesn't happen. Say, people can go just, to jail. Say, all kinds of things that still come out and let do what they're say, doing. Queen, let me just say, I get that, because these people, they're not coming from where mine's coming from. Innit? So, the truth be told, all these times when I thought they were fucking with me, mm. they were just fucking with me because I was... Popular, mm -hmm. fucking me because I was in the in club, mm -hmm. fucking me mm. through fear. Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? And mm. what it is is these clowns, and I'm gonna say it again, clowns mm. has taken away that fear factor because now the fear factor has moved to them. It's like that. It's like the film Juice, isn't it? Like it's like okay, they've got the juice. They must have the juice, isn't it? Because they've took the juice off the man. What they, they used to fear, isn't it? So it's like now. They fear that, innit? Do you get what I'm trying to say? So, do you know what I mean? That's the in crowd and it's just how it is. Do you know what I mean? It's just how it is. Mm. And I saw that early, and it, which is why I built my own platform, which is I had to take two steps back mm -hmm. and I had to just build up my sort and kind of just get over it and see it for what it was. So when people say, oh, yeah, it's bitter, it's bitter. Yes, safe. Because guess what? I have a right to be bitter. If you want to call it bitter, then call it that. Do you get what I'm trying to say? Well, as far as I'm concerned, I have to write. Because if you go, like, I've just done a lot for these people, innit? it? So it's like a slap in the face. You get what I'm saying? Because like you said, innit, there was no aftercare. Mm. Do you get what I'm trying to say? Like, it was like, okay, that's happened. And it's like, you lot was happy that that happened. Because if it was the other way around, I promise you it wouldn't be the same thing. Do you mm. get what I'm saying? I'd be the bad guy still. Bro, why did my man do that? Do, 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 do. You're lucky, they're lucky do, that do. you didn't even sue them. Because you know that mean? was in the in the changing room where there were celebrities there and there was no security. Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? In their event. Yeah, yeah. That was America there to get sued. Yeah, you understand yeah. what I'm saying? Because what's it called? Draco. Is it Draco? The one that got killed. His mum suing them at the event because he got rushed and stabbed and, and killed. Do you understand what I'm saying? Mm. Because it wasn't... Do you understand what I mean? But, you know... But, yeah. But... So, after that, 
your mindset and everything led you to say, fuck it, you're going to do your own thing then. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. you've got your, your label now, yeah. Mm, mm, mm. And then you've got your artists, including me. Cream, you know the ones there? The hardest. Come on, because I heard you on one of your um, interviews. Remember the one what you done with Drunk and Jay? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And he was like, would you ever have a female? Yeah. And he was like, yeah, but I know so you have to write for her. Do you remember? Yeah, you always want to get that out. I had like, to get that out. Have you ever wrote for me? Like, you always I just want to get, get that out. No one knows. Right, the only person that's helped today, me, man. though, is my brother Busy. My brother Busy my taught me how today, to rap. Man. But I just got to say that. My day to day, man. Even though Cream's the hardest always my with the man, them, the man, them don't write Cream's bar. ZZ can tell you as well. They know how Cream's pen is. Do you get what I'm saying? Just had to say that. Yes, anyways, yeah. I've helped you, man. Uh, when, when yeah, I'm saying I ain't with a few bars. Well, I've said, I've no, but if we're ideas, if man. we're in the studio or whatever, ideas, and you know when your vibes in as whatever, but yeah. you know when I'll you say, say cream, busy, I need no. a six. No, no, yeah, come on, saw still you, now, saw yeah. still. But when you say cream, sixteen yeah, yeah, yeah. studio, yeah, yeah, yeah. everyone's writing, or yeah, yeah, yeah. you need your verse, whatever, whatever, whatever. I know it's quality. Do you get me? No, it's quality. And um, mm. but you know what though, that could have, that should have gone on for a bit longer because we used to have that studio sessions was too fun. There was too much joke and whatever, whatever. But then um, we kind of just went into a different direction. Yeah, the podcast. Podcast. Mm. That's what's lead. Hold on, let me just make sure I ain't left out nothing yet before I get into this. Yeah, because then we started doing that podcast. Yeah, me and me. Yeah, to put that bit in there. Me and me, you know. Yeah, I put that in my notes. Everybody else. I put <laughs> oh my gosh! Are you hearing this, son? I got that in fact? my notes. Are you hearing this? Yeah, are you hearing this cause? Oh, to your record me label, and, me. and then yeah, me and me, yeah. and then do you understand what I'm saying? Come on, but yeah, yeah so yeah, so you know, then obviously um, we started doing a podcast. Mm. Do you get me? Because obviously we used to chat about them things and everything. Do you get what I'm saying? And talk mm-hmm. about how they don't give you a seat at the table, make your own table. Do you understand what I'm saying? It's all about, like you said, remember you uploaded all your videos, put them on your channel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You took everything off. Took everything, you get what I'm saying? Like, I mean, mm. like by the time Mike tried to do it, Base 79 had got involved. <laughs> yeah, do you get you me? what I'm saying? Yeah. But I've done it before, Base 79. <laughs> Got involved, you get me? Like, I was yeah. the reason for them to even mm. draw for base 79. They really because no one ever thought about doing that before. Mm. It's cut like mm. so. If you get me? Mm. They know it's 24 hour badness, mm. so they couldn't yeah. DM me and say, Yo, they couldn't say nothing. Mm. You get me? So at them time, remember, I was ch- I was moving like it was on for posty. Mm-hmm. I was going mad, you get me? Safe posty, yeah, you pe- get me? I sorted out my things. mental health. I've sorted out my mental health, but I remember I posted a video of him. Saying East London, say East London and all that. Mm. I went crazy. Was that you? It was me, I posted it. I leaked What's it. it I leaked it. What's it? I leaked it. You get what I'm saying? For real? I, I didn't it. even know that. I leaked, totally. it. I leaked it. You get what I'm saying? A man's DM'd me. Someone's DM'd me. Like, someone that didn't, they didn't have the balls. Oh to, they didn't have God. the balls to leak it. Yeah. They DM'd me from a fake account. Look what, it might have even been a girl. I don't know. Mm. But it's being sent to me. Immediately I posted. I've got a strike on this channel. For this, <laughs> there's a strike on the YouTube for that. You get because I tried to do it. On, I've put it everywhere. Mm-mm. You get me everywhere. Post he phoned up his friends at YouTube immediately. Said, this has got to go down. But man said, say East London. Like, where are you from in East, bro? Mm. Like, why not say there? Like, why didn't you make a say there? Like, why the whole of East London? I like these. Are you gonna say say no? Or are you gonna say your ends in it? You gonna say yo say. You know what I'm saying? You're going to say City Church Road. <laughs> you know the one thing you're going to say? You know the one thing you're not going to say? Say the whole of them. Yeah. Like, yo, say, you hit me. Oh, mate. You're going to say Deeks. You get what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> you get what I'm saying? Like, the man says, say the whole of East oh, London. Oh, mate. Why for that? <coughs> <coughs> no, but you know, I think you trying to do a camera on, it? Mm. And it just went wrong. Mm. You get me? And the thing was tired as well. Mm. Like, it wasn't even the illers. Like, it was a mad tired thing that you just don't film. You don't film that. You don't even want to remember that you've done that. Hmm. You get me? Mm-hmm. So, it's some ginger to, oh, I'm going to you crazy. But big you up, Posty. You get what I'm saying? You know why I say big up, Posty? Because throughout all of that, mm. 
mm. he kept his decorum because I was going mad still. Mm. And really, I was just, I was mad in it because, like you said, like there was nothing like you didn't come and say nothing. And that was my thing in it. So, but I had to big him up on how he dealt with it because he didn't say a word. Do you get what I'm saying? See, like how Rashid with my, and he's mm. saying all of this stuff. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. Pulsey just knew that's not for me. He just yeah. man, we just you just see him pop up with these. Now got security. He, do you get what I'm saying? He just knew the levels. Do you get what I'm saying? He's not trying to get involved in that. He's a businessman. I'm not him. Do you get what I'm saying? I'm past that. You see, I'm, that's where I think Rashid should have took it, kind mm, of thing. Because mm, mm, if you mm. know you're not in the wrong, then just shut up. Mm. You don't even need to. Do you mm. get what I'm saying? As far as Pulsey's concerned, in his head, he must think he's not in the wrong. Mm. Or whatever he thinks. Do you get what I'm saying? Because he didn't say a word. He didn't even try and defend nothing. Do you get what I'm saying? So, yeah. Yeah. I have to begin up on that. Because when, when things was good, these guys was all right. And I can't es- expect anything more from them. Because they're not from where I'm from. I keep telling, man. Do you get what I'm saying? Like, do you know what I mean? They're mm. not from where man's from. They're not built like man. They haven't got man's morals or... Mm. Do you know what I mean? So I can't expect certain things of them. Do you know what I mean? Because I don't know that world what they're in. Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? They're just trying to protect whatever they're trying to protect. Do you get me? Yeah. Business, show, whatever. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But yeah, podcasts, we move. You know what I mean? Yeah, we move. Real and the most, you get me? And I see everyone trying to do all this gang up, gang up, and right side, wrong side, but I don't give a shit about none of that. I'm just going to turn up every week, every other week and talk and have um, a good conversation with our guests. Mm-hmm. And um, yeah, that's that's our main priority, mm. you know, and it's, it's worked so it's far. It's worked and I feel... Coming on two years. Yeah, coming on two years. Mm. Um, I've definitely seen, in that short space of time, like we've covered a lot before me coming into the picture with our TM label. But in that sp- short space of time, I've literally seen a transition in you. Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? Big. Because mm. I remember when you was on, in RTM label, you was kind of much more on rage mode. Do you know like what I'm that, saying? Man. With the music, Kind Master and that. Ah, oh, fuck off. Do you get <laughs> dude, Fuck off, dude. Fuck off, dude. Fuck off, dude. Fuck off, dude. Yeah, man, was, that was yeah. mental health still. Do you know what I'm saying? That was mental health. She but, just um, used to always laugh with me. I always used to laugh. Do you understand? I had something called Kind Master. Like, I used to, to make videos. Do these videos on. This is, you know, like if you've got InShot or whatever, what you your make your little videos on, on your app. Just a little see, app. See, but his one used to say Kind Master at the side. He didn't even she used, used to, to take like, the logo. Please take off the Kind Master. Logo. Do you know, just make his own videos, gaining crazy. Do you get what I'm saying? I just used to be like. pictures. Yeah, it was just crazy. It was funny to me. Like, I just used to find it so funny. Like, I used to look on the Instagram and see another Kind Master video popping mm. up. This guy, get man, me? every day for ages. But um, we had some talented people on there. And um, I did, remember we done the black box and all of that? Um, yeah, we done the black, black box. Black box freestyle, do you get me? But um, Big freestyles. But yeah, still. some big freestyles, like, yeah. So like, anyway, like I was saying, I see a big transition in you, even health-wise. We didn't really get too much into like, how you know like how you've been like you know like in recreational stuff and you know like you've been you yeah I was to, on drugs yeah yeah yeah, you yeah, 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 yeah you was a, that's yeah, what I was yeah. saying like yeah do you know what I mean yeah, like you're, you're healthy now yeah I'm healthy you stop Shall smoking we? weed do you get what I'm saying weed. you know you put on stop weight smoking everything you're back in yeah exactly you're, but, but remember before when we started you were smoking the weed yeah, 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 do you know what I mean? You put on the weight and all of that. You're back in the gym. Do you get what I'm saying? So I just feel like it's up and up, upwards. Do you get what I'm saying? Yep, yep, yep. Even like the conversations that we have, your mindset seems to be much more clearer. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. Certain things that you're able to talk about now, which you wouldn't even speak about then. As let so me know. So I her up. What's her name? I know. I know. What's her name again? Jada. 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 Oh, Jada. And there was some there one was else that, that didn't love. Yeah, I know. And like anyone that asked ask you anything, he was just like, Why didn't they Do you like, understand what I'm saying? Like, crazy. Well, like, don't ask me about Don't that. ask him nothing. But you know, like, everything is timing in it. Do you get what I mean? So it's all about timing. 
people that have been following you can see your growth. Everyone's human, isn't it? Everyone makes mistakes and whatever. The most, the main thing for me is that no one stays stagnant. Do you understand? And it's that you're growing in the right way, not growing backwards. Do you understand what I'm saying? It's different if you're hearing all of those stuff now. You're hearing all of those stuff. You understand what I mean? So, um, but yeah. Um, I want to know about you now. How's your mindset now? What are, what are you looking for? What 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 are you got coming up? Are you would you ever think about? I know you've got a project, so let's talk about that because everybody keeps saying when they want more music from you. I so, haven't necessarily got a project still, cause but you're gonna do. You're gonna, not, yeah, I don't want to put no pressure on. Okay, don't put no. Yeah, okay, cool. DMing me asking when when's this coming out and when's that coming out. Yeah, but I've been recording neatly. Yeah, yeah. you get. What I'm trying to say yeah. I've been recording neatly. I intend to put something out by the end of this year, you know, just to let them know, man, still talking what I'm talking. Do you get what I'm saying? As an artist, <laughs> you get what I'm saying? Yeah. As an yeah. artist, you get what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm still capable. I got my feet. Do you know what I mean? I'm still capable of saying heavy stuff on, on, a, on a beat, you know, because obviously they might have forgotten. Mm. You get what I'm saying? Where... The main influences come from. Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? So, what I let them there's know. There's the influences, yeah. and then there's the influence that influence the influences. Do you get yeah, me? Yeah, but yeah, so, yeah, man. And um, yeah, I just want to apologize in advance. Do you get what I'm saying for all the gun talk? You get me? I'm only chatting shit. Not really gonna shoot them. I'm joking. <laughs> I'm joking. I know. See, I can't even help it. But that's what I'm saying. Mm. But as an artist. When I get in the booth and certain beats, mm -hmm. that's why I get diggity. I can get why he's on his madness. Mm -hmm. It's the beat. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. But nah, I got bare. There's different tracks on this. So yeah. Get me. But I, I, can't I, I, I the get pain. it as well. I get, I get where you're coming from because you know me. I do my music. I like to chat my smack and all of that. And I said, as well as I get what, what you know, we're bigger and whatever, whatever. But I love my rap in it. Do you get what I'm saying? I love my music so I definitely gotta do some more stuff what about acting Anything acting like that any movies if the money's right you know the money's right the money's right but yeah like going back to um I can't believe I forgot what? my boy you get me my son we got Keon that's my you get what I'm saying that's a major part of my transition in life. And yeah. It's my boy, you get me? Yeah, big up your young king, man. So, yeah. That was like a big reason for allowing a lot of people that should be dead. You know what I'm saying, man? And my boy, you get me? Mm -hmm. Like, just, um, I like how he's growing and all yeah. that. You know? And big up Hayley because she's done an amazing job. How many times job. are you going to big her up? I'm not. Oh my God, no, I haven't done a lot. I was going like, to, I'm just every saying. Every single time. Like, no, I have not. Listen, I I've think not you're healed. just. I've not healed. Okay, sorry, but I'm you just saying, saying I've done an ama you yeah. both have done an amazing yeah, job. Like, You've got an amazing son. You're, you're talking about your son, so we're just touching on that. I wasn't going to because you're going, you like to go up. on. Winding There's certain up, things that I, because I know I'm he loves to go up. on with himself, you know, but anyway, yeah. You've got an amazing son. You've got a young king. You lot are doing an, you lot doing a, are doing an amazing job with him. She's done amazing. I'm just saying, big up. Yeah, yeah, always no, big, big, no, big up the mums. No, big her up, man. And big I was up, going man. to say another thing I'm as well. You, um, you know, I just wanted to um, say like, you know, RIP to your mum and big up your queen, your mother, because you queen. always mention her on the show. I had never got the opportunity to meet her. But she sounds like she's been a, a big, big, big influence in your life. Do you yeah, understand yeah. what I'm saying? Like... She, you know what I mean, innit? I so I just wanted to... After brain, innit? That's what I'm saying. So I just also wanted to, like, you know... So we're very similar. Yeah. You get me? So I just wanted to give give a special shout-out and, you know, like a special big up to your mum and everything. Do you yeah. get what I mean? But, yeah. Yeah, no. Hayley actually made me... That's... um, Make That Journey is one of my biggest tunes, so I owe her that. Mm. She made me able to make a big, big tune. I see it there. Yeah, I'm saying maybe like the one where you say driving to your drive on a band yeah, just drive to up to Bake, yeah. Big, big and cheer. even on the bar with the um mm. you know um the hometown mm. there's a bar in there that I was like bop bop they said it must be my baby mother's dumb. 
Do you remember when they said, yeah, yeah, I could, yeah. you know what I'm talking about, Bob Barber, yeah. 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 When I put my drum in, yeah, but yeah. Yes. They said that they were looking for the gun, but yeah. Um, and then Daddy's little soldier, my boy, allowed me to make a big, big tune. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, you know, mm-hmm. mommy don't cry, but mom allowed me to make a big, big tune. Mm-hmm. Me. And big up your sister as well. Big up my sister. And big up your brother. Space, scheme, space scheming. Big up your brother because from this interview, what I've gathered, he kind of inf- he kind of pushed you to do your music. He obviously heard that there was something there. No, he's, a, he's a DJ in it. Do you get so what I'm saying? You get me? He's a DJ, so he's very musical. Mm. So he, he just happened. He just happened to just have beats and just said it there with the um, mm. thing. You know. And is there anything else? That um, you want to touch on that you feel like I didn't. Well, you know, we'll get it at some point because it's like your story. It's not, you know what I'm saying. We didn't get everything out. Yeah, and you get me. And it, <coughs> it, was, it was actually a shame that we had to take it down at 16k. Yeah, that was such a shame. Yeah, because it had all the comments as and well. And the comments and, and everything. You lot, please just run it up like you've never seen it before. Please write comments in there like it's the first time. Yeah. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? But, yeah. But, yeah, no, we'll, we'll get, like, if anything, you lot ask me. Um, yeah, I'll like, spray some comments else. and he'll answer them back in, this, in, the, in, the, in the episode. Yeah, in the future episode. Yeah, in the future whatever. episode, if there's anything. Literally, I can keep going. I've got so much more to talk about but the book when I do eventually get to write it mm. um, it will have everything in there mm. um, the reason I've not been able to finish it unfortunately is because um, my life has been so traumatic and filled with PTSD <laughs> <laughs> that every single time it's coming up to something traumatic I kind of like just put it down because I don't even want to relive it mm. do you know what I mean that's mm. why even today has been like bit of a counselling session mm-hmm. and I just didn't want to relive certain things mm-hmm. but mm. I just done it for the show you get me mm. but um yeah no just get get give me my fire round because my story is already been over two hours yeah well but it has to be it yeah, come on to yeah I'm not just yeah we had to but yeah anything else that's why I had to get my son in there. I thought, how am yeah. I not mentioning my son? Like, mm. you get me? Yeah, come on. But yeah. Yeah, big up your one son. Big up your king, your young king. But yeah, nah, man. Run me through this big fire up the kids. Round. Right, fire round for you. <clears throat> Two pack of Biggie. Two pack. Little Wayne or Drake. Little Wayne. Jay Z or Nas. Nas. Dr. J or Easy E? Easy E. DMX or Ja Rule? X. Get Rich or Die Trying or Reasonable Doubt? Get Rich or Die Trying. Really? I thought you was going to say Reasonable Doubt because you're always getting on to everyone about that one. No, but I was going to say both. But was you? I was, but if we're going for track by track by yeah. track by track oh gosh because of Dre yeah. in it like Dre's got the beats in it but reasonable doubt like it's just a reasonable classic. doubt it's a is classic a co- yeah get you rich get or die trying though Jeez. like reasonable doubt is a classic mm. and um, like my right hand man used to just love that mm. pumps you get me and it mm. just made him make a lot of money mm-hmm. so that CD that I will definitely recommend to any up and coming trappers <laughs> <laughs> you get me I saw I saw the change in, in that guy mm. listening to that album you get me because we used to kind of be on par after that then he was listening to Get Rich or nah, he was listening to Reasonable Doubt and I can't remember what I was listening to maybe even Get Rich or Die Trying but his thing went elsewhere with his paper game you get me mm. so and my thing went elsewhere on Rude Waiting so mm. but yeah God. Method Man or Red Man Loud that Method come on Mob Deep or D-Block? Mob Deep. Really? Yeah. R.I.P. P. You know why? Because P followed me, innit? He, mm. he followed me on Instagram mm. before I lost that um, young underscore spray account. He followed me, right? Mm. So. Hard, innit? Hard. 
um, vibes or Mavado. What are the last one? Bounty or Beanie. Bounty? Mm. Cobra or Ninja. You're asking me this because I'm a little Yardi. Yeah, I know. Because <laughs> you're a little Yardi Smile Island. I'm Dominique. I'm about to move like a Jamaican. Come on. I knew we did all the Yardis in the The way how you know them, I, f- I was like, you must be a Yardi, but no. Mad Cobra or Ninja Cobra? For real? Cobra. Is it? Yeah, man. Cobra bad, bro. Idonia or, or Busy? I don't know. Really? Even though you went through the... Busy, busy, was busy, busy was hard. Busy was hard, though. Busy you know? was hard, but see, if I and he don't sounds know. exactly the same on busy, stage. Busy was hard, but I'm telling you, see, if, if Donia was there, mm. like I would have went mad as well, type of thing. I should have. Uh, Alkaline or um, Massacre. Massacre. I knew he's gonna say Massacre. Massacre is your artist, isn't it? Yeah. Popcorn or Black Rhino. Poppy. Poppy. Dexter Daps or Intense. Yeah. Over Dexter. Why for Dexter? <laughs> now Dexter's hard, but he's for the girl. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, Skilly or Skeng? What, 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 what. Um, Skeng. But Skilly, though, car. Skilly's got beer rhythm, though, but... I think it's... Um, I think it's Skeng for... Skeng for, the, for the... Skeng for right now. But I wouldn't know. I can't. Yeah, we'll have to. Yeah, no. Yeah. But with Skeng, I don't know if the longevity, if he's gonna be able to still have the be longevity there. of Skilly. Skilly, he's just yeah, and he's his thing's a bit mad, isn't it? Because he don't, like I don't have him off as the biggest lyricist still. But he's, but he's just got a way. He's just got a way about him where he just says anything. And quickly, it, and it, and it, and it's in a, any and it's, way, yeah, and it's gone. Wah, 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 and it's wah, a hit. Wah, wah. I don't even know how he's even yeah, getting through. That, yeah, how he's getting people to do that. Like, yeah, wah, 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 and that's did making. you see the how Chris Brown was dancing? Have you seen that meme with the um the, the thing with Chris Brown? Step out with me, grab with me, Wait, brand the way new gun. Chris Brown done that wap wap. Brand new gun. He's a rifle walk and Brand new gun. Brand new. Like, he you. thinks mad. Money treat like money treat like he. Like, yeah. yeah, skilly things, but, but skeng for right now. In Squash or chronic law? That's a hard one, but chronic though. Chronic still, you get me? Beris or Sanchez? Beris, man. Beris is hard, isn't yeah, it? but Sanchez, I love you Sanchez don't Sanchez as well. Sanchez. No, I can't. I swear Sanchez. But Beris, you can't, like. Sanchez is hard, but Beris is hard. Sizzler or Capleton? I think Beris is my mum's artist. Yeah, Beris is my mum's artist. Sizzler or Capleton? Sizzler. 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 Capleton in it, car. But Sizzler. You get what I'm saying? I rate Capleton still, but Sizzler's just Sizzler. Sizzler's boy. There's Mm. something about Sizzler. Too much much for them. Oh, fucking. I was going to sing one of them, but. Try a cry. New in it. Come on. You know as soon as you hear that tune, though, in it differently. Come on, might have to play that after. Um, Elephant Man or Harry Toddler? Why does it have to be this? Way? You know, in it, it's just <laughs> in your head now, in it. Come on, tuna. Got beer in Even it. Even my heart cries, but who cares? Got beer in it. Who's my and because I, I can't sing it, you know, that's my, I just can't help it. Um, yeah, Elephant Man or Harry Toddler? Toddler. For real. Elephant Man are fools. Like. No. Look, don't say no, that. No, but he's too much jump. Ellie, like, though. But it's too much. He just turned into. Remember, scare them was might like I rated scare them mm. for them. I rated Ellie, Ellie straight away, you know. But then he start turn two. He was just doing too much cut, cut circus thing for me. Um, SWV or TLC? Right here. SWV. Right here. I know, like you, you pick TLC yeah. here, but. SW. Even though I was listening to some SWV the other day, you know what it just is? came on. Every their voices there. are sick. Yeah, them but time you see, there, TLC like is my era, like for the trend and the style. You know what I mean? That sound, and it was just more. You know what I'm saying? Mm. So I got a different elements. So like SWV, man. Oh gosh! Yeah, you know I'm saying for them time there. Yeah, you know I'm saying. I used to wish I could sing. For them time there, you still um, do. I definitely still do. I but I sing regardless. Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? Um, Brandy or Monica? 
Monica, but yeah. Brandy for voice. Monica's voice is hard as well. Yeah, no, but, but Brandy, yeah. she's got a mad voice. Yeah. Beyonce Monica's or Shanti. Shanti. Shanti, I knew already you was going to say that. You love a Shanti, innit? I'm just not going to pick Jigga's girl. Really? Girl. Is that why? I'm going to love Jigga, man. Um, little Kim or Foxy? Um... Kim, you know, for her early, but just because uh, of her face and how she's changed, like Foxy, in it. But I would have picked Kim, though. For real? Yeah, good because Biggie's like, come on, Junior Mafia. Like, when she come true, like, she. Even with Foxy, when she went on the yard style and she was with Jay Z and all of them, she's hard, you know? Yeah, come, you can't tell me about what? Foxy, but Yo. Kim, Kim in it, like, for back then, do you get what I'm saying? Mary or Faith Evans? Mary, man. Stacy Dash or Nia Long? Stacy. I swear Nia Long and me got the same birthday, I think, you know. Halle or Jada Pinky? Halle Berry. Jada Pinky back in the day, but Halle Berry, like, if we're talking about now, like, longevity. But I used to love um, Jada back in the day, mm. so it's the fancy, yeah. I used to love Jada as well. She's the reason why I think I cut my hair short and blonde, you know. That's the fancy. Yeah, I even done my hairstyle like hers. I used to love her. Um, Chris Brown or Usher? Why for that? You're not going to answer? Why? I swear you've asked this in the fire yeah, no, before no, about Usher, why Usher, for Usher, that. Usher, Usher. <laughs> Usher, but I'm not, saying, I'm not saying it to myself. Though. Don't try it. Bobby Brown or Michael Jackson? Aye, man. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, Bobby, Bobby, Bobby. Bobby, I still go, really? But Michael, obviously, like, as far as, like, music, like, music and all that, you can't chat that. Whitney or Mariah? Whitney. Adele or Amy? Amy. Steph or Miss Banks? Both. Ice cream or Trillery? Cream. Come on. R&B or hip hop? <laughs> hip hop. Coke or Pepsi? Coke. Fanta or Tango? Fanta. Orange or apple juice? Apple. Strawberry or chocolate nourishment? Oh, <laughs> why that? You're lucky you changed it to nourishment. That was about to get wide. I thought he was asking me about chocolate milkshake. You know? Yeah, chocolate nourishment still. Chinese or Indian? I forgot to talk about when I broke my joy in school. You know, I had to drink beer nourishment. Chinese or what? Indian. Chinese. I realize I've got beer stories. Italian or Turkish? Turkish. McDonald's or Burger King? Burger King for the burgers, but I just always go McDee's, man. Because there's more McDee's. Um, rice and peas or jollof? Rice and peas. And bashment or soca? <laughs> <laughs> Mind games. <laughs> Mind games, soca man. You're trying to mind games, my yeah. You're trying to mind games, my island. Soca man, yeah. Booyo. Yeah. Booyo. And that. That's not it. No. How can that be it? No. <laughs> oh my gosh! Hold on, yeah, hold on. I remember I got some more pizza. Hot soca. It's so gassed on my one with the soca, you know. I thought that was my my last one. Pizza Hut or Domino's. Domino's. KFC like or Nando's? Garlic pizza. Garlic what? I like the garlic pizza thing in Domino's. I thought you would have said Pizza Hut though. No, I, said, I just told you why though. I no, I know, but Domino's. I thought you would have said Pizza nah. Hut. Nah, nah, nah. KFC or Nando's? Nando's, man. I just had Nando's on my way here. Restaurant or cinema? Restaurant. Yeah, come on. It has to be restaurant though, isn't it? Food, man. Chicago Bulls or LA Lakers? Bulls. Jordan. New York Knicks or Boston Celtics? Knicks. Michael Jordan or LeBron? Jordan. He, 23. Mm. 23, isn't it? Come on. It's my birthday. Messi or Ronaldo? Mm. Ronaldo. Ian Wright or John Barnes? John Barnes, man. Barnesy, man. Yeah? Dwight York or Andy Cole? Andy Cole. Frank Lampard or Steven Gerrard? Willard. Jurgen Klopp or Pep? Should be a 
Jürgen. Jürgen. Jürgen or whatever it is. Look, man. Alex Ferguson or Mourinho. Fergie. Javon A. Davis. Javon A. Tank. You, you're not even letting me finish. Or, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, but that's why I rate Tank. Whoever you're going to say. Okay. Who Mike Tyson or all? Ryan Garcia. Garcia is a fucking... But tank, I just got Tank. You change your mind? Nah, nah. Tank. Garcia is a good fighter. Great okay. fighter. Mike Tyson or Muhammad Ali in their prime? Tyson. Car or bike? Car. BMW or Mercedes? Mac. Audi or VW? Audi. Lam or Bugatti? Bugatti. Ferrari or Bentley? Bentley. Porsche or Range? Range. Jeep or Coupe? Coupe. Nike or Adidas? Nike. Gucci or Louis? Louis. Is it? I'm sure you said Gucci Louis. the last time. No, that's you, Louis. Versace or... <laughs> I've always said Louis. Is it? Yeah. Gucci or um, Versace or Moschino? Where for both of them? No. Those are, those are mosh pants, though. Mm. Mosh? Yeah, those are mosh pants, though. Designer or sportswear? Designer. Inside or outside? Indoors or outdoors? Inside or outside in summer? Looks or personality? Looks. Natural or surgery? Natural. Bad gal or good gal? Both. Foot punch, shoulder or doggy? <laughs> Missionary or hair on top? Both. Sex toys or no sex toys? Both. <laughs> <laughs> All of them. Tick, 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 tick. <laughs> and money or love? Money. Mm. I'm kind of, do you know what? Lately, yeah. You're draining the money. <laughs> <laughs> it's no, but money it's not it. even, no, but it's not even about... I don't Red really even had to tell it. No, money but you, do you know what it is? It's not even like I know what them are meaning. You know, when I was like, yeah, but love, love, but do you know what? You see the way how I'm on my grind, like how everything can, it's just, just you know what I'm saying, like money as well, you know. Money. Money and love. It's both for me. Do you know what you it is? What money, saying? isn't it? Like, uh, but it's, when it's all said and done and it, the love disappears and it's, you're not going to be happy with it if the love disappears and there's no money. Mm. So it's better you have money for you know what I'm saying? Mm. And that is my fire round. Go on. Yeah. So come on. To RTM banner, then we come back with it. I know you got, got um, current, current topics. Quickly yeah. though. All right, cool. So current affairs is hold on, fucking hell, let me get them out. Women, England team. Big big you lot up. Come on. Uh, they what they won the um World Cup finals, mm-hmm, I saw mm-hmm, that. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Kelly, she's a good player. Mm-hmm. She got scored the winning goal. Big her up. You can get me the next one. And imagine to my um, Reds when they tell me to play um, football as well. Like it's like you foresee it being big to get me. But yeah, mm. quickly, swiftly moving they had on. Yeah, the biggest crowd as well. Yeah, for the yeah. Final big for them final. up though, differently. Big you lot up. Females big up, are um, doing it. Jade like, as come well. on. Yeah, the Reds look consistent. yeah Jade, big baby. you up. Big you up. Big up all of the young ones right now doing your sports. Continue. Keep doing it. Stay focused. We're loving it. Um, Love Island final. It's got to be David Day and Akinsu. Yeah, did you see their date? Yeah. It got. I felt. I felt it when I saw their date. I thought their date was the most like you know like the way her, her eyes looked. She could see that like, she kind of looked like she was in love. You know, when she went to cry. She get me. I cried on a couple of days. she's a slut. <gasps> Come on, that's harsh. That's too much. It's mm-hmm. too much. That was too much. No, but everyone just That's goes too much. Mad, she, they say, oh, this, that, but she was... That's too much. She was getting fingered and gave man... Who a, was? Yeah. I missed that bit. Who was? Casa Amor. Was she? Yeah. But, but come on, let's not do that, though. Mm. All right. Um. <laughs> <laughs> they're, all, they're all sluts. No, don't say that. Did you see when the parents came, though? What's his name's daughter? Um, Paige's dad. The, she she was like, no, she was like, um, Dad, have you seen it? He's like, I saw the first episode, that was it. I didn't watch it again. 
Mm. I, that's like literally, yeah, that would be red. So you wouldn't be watching it off the time. She wouldn't be going anyway. But anyway, um, um, are you here? Um, did you hear about Neil's wife? No, who's Neil? Neil, the artist. I don't know him. Maybe, maybe the tune. Maybe with the tune. What? Well, go on. Miss Independent. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. You know Neo, yeah, innit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So he basically, oh, basically, his wife just posted on Instagram. Mm. They was married. Then mm. just the other day, they renewed their vows. Yeah, and she's just posting. She says, "Title: Eight years, eight years of lies and deception, eight years of unknowingly sharing my life and husband with numerous of women who sell their bodies to him unprotected." Bitch. Every last one of them. To say I'm heartbroken and disgusted is an understatement. Bitch. To ask me to stay and accept it is absolutely insane. Fuck the wanna. mentality of a narcissist. I will no longer lie to the public or pretend that this is something it isn't. No I cares. choose me. I choose happiness. I choose health and my respect. I gained three beautiful children out of this, but nothing else but wasted years and heartache. I ask that all it, that you all please stop sending me videos or information of him cheating because what he does is no longer my concern. I am not a victim. I am choosing to stand tall with my head held high. If someone can't love you the way you deserve, then it's up to you to love yourself. With no hate in my heart, I wish him all the best. Oh, shut up. Shut up, <coughs> his wife. Shut up. We've heard this all before. Do you get what I'm saying? Get on with it. Do you get what I'm saying? Like, who cares about her? Who is she? No, what, what did she do out here why she needs to leave some big... She's moment. a public, you know, she's in the public eye, I suppose. Oh, I don't so know. She's no, done this and then he's basically said, can you lot respect our privacy? Do you get me? He wants privacy throughout it all. Yeah, but so she's what's not your being thoughts private. on when yeah, women not, do that? She's not being private, like, do you know what I mean? Like, I just think she didn't, she didn't need to, like, as she needed to say all of that to him, not to the whole world. Do you get what I'm trying to say? Like, say it to him. Like, what are you saying? And you know he, what he does as well. Why are you trying to out him like that? Do you get what I'm saying? Because mm. when he, like, I'm sure he must have peeled off how many times? Do you get what I'm trying to say? So when it was good times, like, we all make mistakes, innit? Man, man are just mental, innit? Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? So sometimes, and it's a bit hard when you've got a girl just throwing this off at you and all that. You get me? Like, we don't ask our dicks to get hard, you know? They just get hard. Do you get what I'm saying? And that's what girl forget. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's not something that... Are you not in your head, Dika? It's not something we're in control of. Do you get what I'm trying to say? Like, do you get what I'm saying? So if girl are throwing this off at man and... Do you get what I'm saying? You've got some girl that'll just get you in certain positions where... I don't I can't even believe I'm here now. Do you get what I'm saying? <laughs> like... I'm going mad. But... Mm, definitely. You know what's worth it? I that, man. I don't rate that. Dickhead girl, you get me? Well, Suck she said mother. stop... No, oh. calm down. She said stop sending her stuff. So basically, he's publicly humiliating her. Because the public have now got things that they can send her of her husband. She made a vow to her husband and they've oh, been married to her for it. eight Next years. Subject. Get out of it. Next you subject. understand what I'm saying? So he's been taking we, his vows. You've been there before, man. So, um, get out of it, Neil's wife, man. Get over it. Do you get me? Get over it, man. Do you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Yeah, and that's my little... You got any? No, nah, man. We're going to go to some RT and banter. You get me? Then we'll come back with the main subject. Mm -hmm. On this diagram, where the clitoris is. Boom, my blood clad. The clitoris. Yeah, get in reverse and rest. Where on this diagram is the clitoris? The clitoris. Do you understand the words that are coming out of my mouth? I reckon this. God Almighty. This looks serious, man. No, 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 I reckon this. I reckon this is a little, little hole. Fucking fool! It's the outside ring, this one I'll say, girl. Bomba rice, bomba blood clot! <laughs> Can you point to the clitoris? Backy boy! A bomba clot like them, you're dead! I'm gonna let what? me down, man! Fuck. Oh, turn on your man, man, your bomb, oh, <laughs> 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 Jump out, oh, oh, jump out! <laughs> hey, 
Why is my ex calling me, man? Hello? Oh my god, I think somebody in my house. What? I think somebody's in the house. How you know? Because I can hear their footsteps. Uh, calm down, calm down. Where you at? I'm in my room. I'm scared. All right, all right, look, look, look. Get under your bed. What? Get under your bed. Get under the bed right now. Okay, okay. Are you under the bed? Yeah, yeah. All yeah. right, now put the phone on speaker so I can hear everything. Okay. I, I hear him coming up the steps. All right, all right. Oh, my God, he in here. He in the room now? Oh, my God, yes, he's in here. She under the bed! That bitch is under the bed! Boom, we're back in the place. You get me back like cook crack. You get mm -hmm, what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Hope you enjoyed that banter. Hope that was funny. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? And um, yeah, hope you enjoyed my story. Obviously, yes. there's so much more of the story that you're gonna get in the film. Um, yeah, but we got the queen. Come on. Well, like a hosting skill because she just badded me of up. Course. You get what I'm saying? She tried bad me up talking about. Had well, to. I was a hot in her, but I weren't even not. I was trying to hot up my hosting skills yeah. every minute, rushing me along. No, no, you're not mentioning this. You didn't mention no, that. No, but basically, um, truth be told, um, we had a cancellation last yeah. minute. So we've just thought, instead of wasting time, mm -hmm. we're just going to do my story because we haven't really done my story because that's something, something we had planned, kind of, mm -hmm. that if there's a cancellation, we just do my story, blah, blah, blah. Mm -hmm. So it was like, yeah, it was she weren't prepared, but... For some reason, she wants the host of the year award. Do you get what I'm saying? So, yeah. Thank you. So, we're going to go into the main subject. And because it was my episode, the main subject today is going to be really the most. Because, obviously, that's my motto. That's um, mm -hmm. what man stand for. That's what this podcast stands mm -hmm. for. It's basically about being really the most. And, um, obviously, to me... Really the most, it's not about the bad boy thing, it's not about the rude boy thing. It's RTM, meaning really the most, also meaning real to myself. RTM, you get what I'm saying? So just keeping it real to yourself, do you get what I'm trying to say? That's why, um, obviously, like, man, see that little episode, um, well, I, um, I think Doug was talking about, ah, uh, you know, because Mike got into him about the train driver or whatever, but... You saw me and Cream. That was just Mike explained what he meant anyway. But mm. me and Cream didn't have no nothing funny to say about that because as far as we're concerned, like even a train driver, whoever, like you're just really the most. If you're keeping it real to yourself, you're really the most in it. So yes. yeah, like it's not just about the bad boy thing. So don't think that we're just here promoting something that um, you know that we shouldn't be promoting. We promote, but we like to promote. Bad boys that's turned good. Do you get what I'm saying? That's what we like to promote. Do you get what I'm trying to say? So that you can see the change in people. We don't just want to promote people that's just been good all their life. Do you get what I'm saying? Because it's just not where we come from. Do you know what I mean? So, mm. yeah. Um, so that's us being real to ourselves because we're just, you know, that's what we was about. That's what we was around. Those are the people that we saw. And it's just nice to see the growth. Mm see the real life, see the transitions and stuff like that. Do you get me? And a lot of the, a lot of the people, that the, the, like my people, them in the streets, and I, I phone them and I try and get them on. They're like, hell no. Mm. Do you get what I'm trying to say? They're like, hell no, because it takes a lot, in it. Mm -hmm. So that's why I have to respect and anyone that actually comes and sits on our chair. So big up size again. Do you get what I'm trying up, to say, Carl? Up. That's what was we were just talking about in the, um, mm -hmm. we were talking about in the break, you know. Because I know size, you get me, and he's, mm. a, he's a serious, he's a serious, you, you get me, so mm -hmm. to see him come and sit down and, um, you know, put himself out, the way he put himself out, mm. I commend him, you know, because it's hard, it's hard to, um, to to do that and show growth, even when he was talking about um, the counselling yeah, thing. Yeah, the therapy. You know, yeah. like I, I rated that because 100%. if that could help, 
anyone out there to go and follow in his footsteps because I'm a man I don't necessarily help people in that way because a lot of the times when it's thrown my direction I'm always like ah oh, nah fuck that I wouldn't be talking I don't want to be talking to um anyone I don't know and rare mm. rare rare so it's good to like get a different point of view in it from a yeah. real nigga you get what I'm saying Come on. and yeah it, it even gave me the thought to think oh well maybe but then I thought fuck that you get what I'm saying no, I'm joking I got cream no, I'm joking <laughs> but um nah so yeah nah really the most and that's why we chose that name for the podcast like, even though cream wants to say hey she chose it you get what I'm saying but it, there was never gonna be any different name for it. Mm. You get what I'm saying? Like, well, that's know. what I thought when you I, get what I'm saying? I when I said it to you. I just thought, what a better name though. You can't. It, it just couldn't be called anything else. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, because that's that's what we do in it. We and mm. thanks to all the listeners and all that as well and the um, viewers, um, because you lot get us as well. You know what I mean? Because I see you lot like the the no filter thing. Mm-hmm. That's that's what we, that's just what we do in it. Like that's why our thing might be a bit long and whatever. But yeah, we just we just like to just keep it real to ourselves and just you know talk about whatever we want to talk about. Um, obviously, we're gonna be looking to get sponsors soon, so it's gonna just switch up a bit. You get me, good Deeks. Deeks is getting on to me. He's like, yeah, for us to get sponsors, I might not. Can say certain things. He gave me half a lot about him and them, and nothing. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? So you get what I'm saying? So you might not be hearing me going mad on the rainbow too much. You get me in the future. You get what I'm saying? Car, we're moving up in the world. You get what I'm saying? Half a mech. We're moving up in the world. So you get what I'm saying? Yeah. Like live and let let live. You get what I'm saying? You do you. You <laughs> me. You get what I'm saying? And that's Straight. that. That's how we're gonna do this thing. You get what I'm saying? So, yeah, big up Coel, my cousin, lesbian, you get what I'm saying? You know, I always draw for Coel whenever it's rainbow time. This is me being real in the most again. You get what I'm saying? Cream being real in the most. Deeks told her don't smoke on camera. Did you, Deeks? She's smoking on camera, it's cool. You get what I'm saying, car? She's letting you know she's the queen. She's been smoking off camera. You get what I'm saying? Yes, Maniac, you get what I'm saying? Maniac. Feeling the most, higher than most, crazier than most. Do you get what I'm saying? Oh my days. Mad, you get me? Deets is going to have a problem now. Everyone else that records here, they want to smoke. But they can't smoke. They can't. Feeling the most. Do you get what I'm saying? They're going to have to pay an extra two bills. And even that. <laughs> do you get what I'm saying? And even that is a possible no. You get what I'm saying? That's a possible no. You get what I'm saying? But I miss my weed though, man. No, I, gotta lie, I miss, miss my it, weed. Man. I miss weed, but like you told me, miss my weed, man. You get me? I, yeah. I want to make this meal quick and fast. You get so quick and fast. Mm. Remember, like, it's a social thing as well, isn't it, for me? See, like, you lot yeah, having a smoke. You know what I'm saying? Cool. Like, it's a social thing. I feel like I'm missing out. Mm. Even I went and link, big up Aggie, I went and link Aggie. Big up Aggie, man. This weekend, you get me on Kramer. Mm. See the God big Love up. 7 bucket thing. Hard. You get me? Yeah. So went and linked them. Cry, I want my one. Yeah, cries for me. Said there was something keeping in um, Bristol, um, I Octane, mm. and Frass, um, Frass and um, Stylo G mm-hmm. was opening there for him. So I thought, you know what, choose Bristol. I ain't seen my big brother for a little while. When it was it was our birthday the weekend before, innit? Mm-mm-mm. So I just shouted him. I said, all right, cool. We're gonna come and do a little. Birthday thing, little late birthday thing. I've gone there. We went there Friday. I just drove back today. <laughs> I can't even help it because he's got me up there, innit? So it's like yeah. I just stay in his yard and we went out every day. I just went to Zara and bought a um, couple of things. Mm, mm. And then, yeah, mm. we just went out. So, yeah, no, big up Clinton, man. Big up Aggie, yeah, man. Yeah, Real nigga, up. man. Come on. Big brother, you get me? I went Three to Prezi's thing. What was, was Prezi's thing? Yeah, here? hard. It was all, all right, you know. I was in there till morning. <laughs> And I looked, yeah. it was daylight by the time I looked, daylight. Yeah, he, knows and I that, he knows how to keep her, he knows how to keep her, yeah, the come, come, come with you. No, he had to work. He was doing Bad Andrew's marquee mm-hmm. party. So he was going to come after, but that finished at what, seven or something like that? Uh, yeah, you, yeah, the man them told me, because mm-hmm. I would have went there if I didn't go to Bristol still. Mm-hmm. But I opted in, innit? I thought, mm-hmm. you know what, let me go and do some networking and, yeah. you see me? 
Yeah. So yeah, now nah, man, it was good, man. Yeah. Get me Bristol. Um, shows man a lot of love mm-hmm. as well. Do you get what I'm saying? I find when I go country, I get a lot of love. I get love in the ends, but it's more like people don't really want to tell you what's on their mind, innit? Mm. They don't want to give you the full ratings. Mm. But but we're there, in the like, city, though, innit? London's more bougie. You know, they're not, they're not like... I think no, you know what I think. I think it's just like everywhere. Like even maybe the Birmingham youths don't get it as much in Birmingham. Yeah, yeah. The Manchester youths don't get it as much in Manchester. Do you know what I mean? It's just how it is. I think you know Jesus mm. said, "No profit is it." Yeah, to exactly. Your hometown, you exactly. Know what I'm exactly. You know what I mean? If you're talented and all that, exactly. It's always gonna be a harder graft. Always gonna be a harder graft. Yeah, Bear yeah. gal in my ends knew I was hard. They know I am still hard, but they tried to ignore the vibe. Mm. But we all know that you're just hating. But what does really the most mean to you, actually? Really the most means staying true to yourself. Do you know what I mean? However it comes. Do you know what I'm saying? You don't have to be perfect. It's not about right or wrong. It's just staying true to your thing, innit? Mm. Do you know what I mean? And that's, that's, that's what I think I am anyway. Mm. I like so to give the raw. Do you know what I mean? Could it rate your thing? Great creams thing still in our deeps. Mm. Yeah, like yo, I see the look of comments and that, but I think they more rate your looks than your personality. What are you talking about? Don't try it. <laughs> he's trying it now again, isn't it, Zeke's? Yeah, he's trying to get me out of character like last episode, but it's not going to work. Last episode, she went mad. <laughs> <laughs> she went crazy. Get me big up flow down, though, but big she went up crazy. Flo Dan. I don't think I went crazy. I have to see it first, she but you was crazy. trying it. But um, no, I'm. We're trying to um, we're trying to do more episodes as well this time. Yeah. I just want you lot to get used to the um, surround. Yeah, the layout, the new layout, you know the I'm new saying? new. Apologies for the last episode, but that's Deke's fault. Remember, we're ro- we're dealing with a road man. You get me? Turn. He's telling us about depression and beer madness. You get me? I'm telling him I'm depressed. He's telling me he's depressed <laughs> as well. That's madness. <laughs> you get me? You're telling your cameraman you're oh, depressed. Oh God! He's telling you don't we're all depressed. He's not even a cameraman. Like mm. a minute, like we we thought we'd lost the twenty, the last twenty minutes of the last episode. That was the next madness. We found it again. Do you get what you I'm get saying? This? But this yeah. is really the most. Yeah. You know and saying? let me know how I did with my with my last minute dot com hosting. Just forget all of that. But he yeah. said it was cool, man. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. But it's last minute dot com. But we're real people. We're so real you're gonna people. Get, you get we're just saying? real, and that's what we want to do. We just wanna. Do you get what I'm saying? Right. Like, I ain't got no time for all that other stuff. You get mm. me? all that fakery. Like, do you know what I mean? Like, I leave people and even saying about, oh yeah, you know, the whole man bigging up hard bodied and all that, and where, where, where. But come mm. on, man. Like, why am I not gonna? Mm. Do you get? what I'm trying to say, like, you don't have to understand. That was a time where no matter what, no one can't take that out of my memory. Like, exactly. You know, me and that guy had done like two big tunes that I'd, I'd love them tunes, grabbing up the graft, mm. fucking call me the madman even, bad man. Mm. He, he jumped on that as well. And I'm asking, it's done. Legendary tunes. And exactly. for, for them time, for that time, yeah, man, Hard Body, that was a mad album. Even Walk in the Park, I've, I'm on yeah. that album. Are you? I'm on the album, More Maniacs, Me, Gigs and Tiny Boots. See it I'm on that album, so you know it's just how things go in it. But um, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna be a liar or try exactly. liar. I'm not gonna be a ekin su. You get me? Liar. And try and move like you get. What I'm saying I will only tell exactly. you how I feel or what. I, you get. What I'm saying it. So if you hear me one day, I'm saying this, that about that guy or that guy. It's still what I feel, and it's still. Yeah. Real sh- like what you have I think, to be real in it, and that's yeah, like me. I always say, I'm me. You're, I, I have, I have my. I'm gonna have my opinion in it. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? And I'm gonna say both not sides. Just gonna, yeah, exactly. I'm not just gonna say, oh, this and that and that and this. If I'm not feeling in my brain, that that's what I like. I'm not lying. Do you get what I'm trying to say? I'm not lying. Like, you get what I'm saying? And no, nah, man. All things said, like all said things put aside. I rate, dude. For um, what he's done musically, you know, like mm. for the scene or whatnot, and you know, we used to talk, you know, and he's given me some good advice. 
you know, in the past. So mm. that um, as well, I take from from that, you know. Like even down, look, the tricky thing, it was all mad. And then now, look, it's cool. We're cool because of time as well. Sometimes you have to give people time, innit? Like everyone's always on to me, but they have to understand I go through things in my own time, innit? Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? And if, when I say it's cool, that's when it'll be cool. Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? No one can't tell me when mm. to be cool. Look, you lot were surprised when I said about the tricky thing because it was just my time to be cool. Exactly. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. I didn't want to... Mm. No one can't tell me when to be cool. Mm. But it's like, with that as well, that situation, like I said, because um, I, I didn't have nothing against him at all. As far as like, obviously like that set or whatever, but personally, you've never done me nothing. Mm. I've never done you nothing. Do you know what I mean? So it was more when the Lippy episode, when I posted the um, thing of him, mm -hmm. and then I got the backlash from certain people from my side, like, yo, what are you posting up? My man, mm -mm. don't you know he was on the corner when woo, 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 when he was there, when woo, woo. Do you get what I'm trying to say? So that's the kind of thing I took away from that, innit? it? So then now I've got that in the back of my brain, right, a man name don't check for my man. So then the next time I've mentioned him in front of, um, we had Judge, in it. Mm -hmm. That's why I said, oh, yeah, Margs and that, boy, my rate there thing, but I don't really care, but I don't really check for my man or whatever I said. Because in the back of my head, I'm knowing, Ra, he's a red flag. The man name's got him off as a red flag. So I've said that, but then he's gone mad and done his madness or whatever. Saying whatever, and this guy obviously he wouldn't. When he's when he's thinking, man went out, or he only came on road. And what did he say? Um, he was only about from two thousand and one. I think he said I only came out into brother. I was in prison. I just said my story. So you're right. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? Oh, when you like, yeah, I was in prison as a little kid. <coughs> but back to the point. He's done all of that. He said, then I've gone madder on Kramer's episode. I want to fight you. I want to do this. So now it's turned into spray and tricky. But everyone that was on my phone talking about this guy, and no one piped up. Mm. Everyone left it as spray and tricky. No one never, like I didn't have, no one saying that. So I've, I've clocked in it. Like, hold on a minute. How did it get to spray and tricky? You get what I'm trying to say, Carl? It wasn't spray and tricky initially. It was me posting, me trying to do my podcast, me just getting on with it. And then because of man phoning me and all of that, it muddled up my head. Then I've said something, then it's got, so I've clocked, in it? You know what, fuck that. You get? And then I saw that thing when he, he done that thing on Hyper and I thought, you know what? Big man thing. Do you get what I'm saying? Like, done over that. Do you get what I'm saying? car that's what we're running it like we're on bigger things we're on to bigger things and we're not trying to do you know what i mean we're not trying to carry on foolishness do you get what i'm trying to say like like i said that's a man that's never done me nothing i've never done that man something do you get what i'm saying if it's a man that's done me something or people around them, them's done me something it's gonna take longer to get over that but timing do you get what i'm trying to say and man can still pay me still you know Man can still DM me. <laughs> Man can still, do you get what I'm saying? We've got middlemen, do you get what I'm saying? There's middlemen still, so do you get what I'm saying? Man can still, that option is still there, you know. We can go back to before the Twitter thing. Do you get what I'm saying? That, um, you, you get what I'm saying? I was supposed to get the, um, I was supposed to get the um, Seattle Gold thing. They were supposed to do me the RTM records. Man can still do that, fam, and we just knock it on the head, and then maybe man can invite me to the next P Diddy party, and <laughs> you get what I'm saying. And we're 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 cash. You get what I'm saying. Everything's pattern. You get what I'm saying. Get me on a track with fucking meat mills or something. Do you know what I mean? But nah, man. You see what I'm saying? Really the most, mm -hmm. and that's what we're about, man. You know what I mean? So and they can't knock it as well. They can't knock it. Come man will say you can hear. All the whatever rule people chat shit or whatever, but then you get people like real people that come and sit on it, like Jaja. Now Jaja will say, oh, "Spades a savage, man." I met Spades a sav like crime, or like, oh, like you get what I'm saying. The proper man, them will make you know, innit? So 
Don't try and start the thing. Get me? The thing can't be started. You get me? It is what it is. Do you know what I mean? It is what it is. Cream take over. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? You're just sitting there, hi. <laughs> no, I'm letting you go with it. You're going to say what you're saying, isn't it? Do you know what I mean? Come on. Really the most. When yeah. did you come up with that? What, really the most? Yeah, I didn't even fucking ask you that. Do you know what? Isn't it? I Shit. got it from um, the first Reasonable Doubt. Look, I keep telling you, look, Reasonable Doubt is my album. I keep it real the most. I know you're feeling it. Ripped up from that feeling it. Didn't feel it. If you go and listen to that Jay Z song on mm. Reasonable Doubt, mm. that's how it opens the verse. I mm. keep it real the most. I know you're feeling it. And just from there, I just thought, real the most, though. Get me. RTM. Get me real the most, though. Like, I got it straight away. Yeah. I keep it real the most. I know you're feeling it. Like, okay, you're not the realist. But you keep it, you're not saying you're the realest thing mm -hmm. out here. But man, definitely keep it real to most people. Because I've met a lot of people mm -hmm. that I'm keeping it realer than. Do you get what I'm saying? So, do you know what I mean? I like to think I keep it realer to, like, when you said even real to myself. Mm. Like, I'm the person that I prefer the ugly truth over a beautiful lie any day. Do you understand mm. what I'm saying? Mm. I don't like to... Live in a safety bubble, if you know what I'm saying. Mm, mm, mm. I don't. I'm not a person that like likes to live in denial or whatever. My my own my brain won't even allow me to do that. Do you understand what I mean? Mm. Um, I notice that if you're that type of person, though, um, especially when you're extra real with the way that you say things, you can hurt people's feelings sometimes. Yeah. A lot of the time, yeah, yeah, yeah. because. You give it to them real and raw, innit? In their mud ass. Do you understand what I'm saying? Mm. Sometimes when people, when you're giving advice and talking to people, you think they want the real answer, but they actually don't. Yeah, they want a comfortable life. They want a comfortable, exactly. Do you get what I'm saying? Mm. You know what? I'm just saying. I know, but carry yeah, on, what man. do you think? I can't believe you're stopping so quick and I ain't thought nothing else to say. <laughs> <laughs> Do you get me? Mm. But don't you think I keep it like I'm like that though? I'm just yes, cream. This is not your episode. It's my. It episode. wasn't about. Well, then talk. It's not always about you. Yes, Who's you saying it's it about me? Most. Yes, yeah. you keep it real in the most. She does keep it real in the most. We heard you last episode keeping it real in the most. Do you get what I'm saying? You're always going mad these days. I think they've seen the other side of you now. Cause you've got I don't to get back to the nice. Side of cream. I haven't done anything a couple of times. Just as yeah, I said, one mind. thing. You know, I can't even help it. Yeah, yeah, come on. I can't even help it. But nah, man. That's why when I when I saw the um when I saw that videos of you, mm -hmm. I thought, who's this really the most girl mm. talking like she's tough? Because I was thinking, who's this um, girl like? You know, like and even as uh, she's chatting and I said, like, come on, oh, and I. Them time I've already met Busy. I know I'm saying it. Going Big up my brother Busy. Already. You get me? Me and Busy was in the streets. You get me on the train. <laughs> when you're Bucky Man on the train. You get me? But he was somewhere quay as well. Because I yeah. swear it must have been in North. Or somewhere where I bucked him. It was the train. He was somewhere quay though. So I was thinking, why this? Because he told me he's from North. So I thought, mm -hmm. why are you here? On this train. But yeah, big up busy, man. Big up busy, come on. My brother as well, you know. Mm -hmm. You get me, That's we got memories still. Mm -hmm. But yeah, man, I was thinking, who's this girl, you get me? Talking like, you get me, she knows the thing, but come to realise she knows the thing, you get me? So yeah, and it's just it's just good how it all ended up, because even, she didn't even want to do this hosting thing, like just her, like, just me, like, did it? That wasn't her initial in it but uh -uh. it just worked out like that we just get a guest yeah we started this thing with the guest guest boom they're following again i'm being really the most again uh -huh. then all of a sudden we was doing premieres to begin with we've been doing premieres boom they weren't doing premieres before now every episode is a premiere boom we started off calling it really the most with, with the um artist name to at, at, at the end and the other people will call it whatever it was with the artist name at the end. Then we changed it to put the artist name to begin with. Then they changed it with the artist name to begin with. Then we started posting shorts. 
they're posting little clips. Then they started posting shorts. They started posting little clips. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? Like, back up, back up. It's cool. <laughs> more I keep going on about no, it. No, but you made me laugh. But you know what? I know what you mean because I told you already. I've experienced it. I keep going and sometimes, on about it. you know, sometimes you just want to say like, Fuck but then off. I'm just gonna get called bitter. But you know you what it is? It's because man do all of that, and then every week get posts up by it made you think here, yeah? and then to people that might not watch our oh, thing and might go. come onto our thing late, they all think that man copied them. But that is the prop. That that is the thing. You know what I mean, that is the thing. What is the problem? And then man wanted because to, if somebody does something like that, and they're getting away with it without you speaking about it, then you're just going to have to look bitter, in it? Because I'm going to speak about it. Mm. Because I'm not going to let you get away with it. And I seen, Didn't you see Khalees the other day? Yeah, Khalees a bad girl. And I, 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 say, I say all of this stuff, but then I, it's like, remember me, yeah? I'm from, look at where I'm talking about. I'm talking about hard-bodied, we the most volume mm, one. Mm, mm, mm. All these times, like, Paul Sterling, he was around them times as well, innit? So it's like, I know the whole dynamics of everything, innit? Mm. So I actually know your begging friend. Like, do you get what I'm saying? Let's not mix, I don't mix my words, in it, Like, really, the most, innit? So I actually know this is a whole big friend thing. Because Giggs was around them times. We was cool, me and Giggs. Giggs, you, know, you know, never used to, like, that, you didn't, where was the link? There's no, tu- like, there's no tune stand, there's no work, like, what, it's a big friend thing. So when I see, like, little people, oh, yeah, my brother, and it's not your brother, like, oh, yeah. Like, I was just telling him, yeah, bro, you done this, you done it again, man. And all this fuck, all that, bro. You got, I'd rather, see me, yeah. I just rather, I'd rather be myself in it. And the wickedest thing, let me just, not even, cause I don't even mm-hmm. want to sound too mental, because I actually like Paul Sterling. Let's not get it twisted. Like, as a person. Do you get what I'm saying? Because that's someone I've linked as well, in it. But I'm just saying, there's certain things I can't read, in it. It's not possible for me to rate in it. You get me? Because thou shalt not best big friend. That's the first thing. And it's just when man say little stuff like, oh, the right side, you're gonna you're gonna press my buttons, innit? Like there's something not right in my head. Do you get and it's always not being right. So it's like certain things is gonna trigger even you get triggered as well. Certain things gonna Come trigger on. me. Do you get what I'm saying? It's like Bobby, like I get I'll get in bad comments about oh I shouldn't have said that about Bobby, but what did I really say? Like I just Getting into like, oh, Bobby was a listener. Right? I like Bobby. Like, me and Bobby talk. Like, do you get what I'm trying to say? Like, I'll phone Bobby for help for, with certain things, and Bobby helps me. Let's don't get it twisted. Do you get what I'm trying to say? But I might get triggered because I see Bobby leave a comment earlier on that day <laughs> saying, do you get what I'm saying? I'm saying, oh, the OG we listen to. I've seen him leave a comment. So that might trigger me, my subconscious. So now you're just a listener, Bobby. Do you get what I'm trying to say? But it's not. Do you get what I'm saying? I'm just, there's something wrong with me, innit? But I'm saying, like, I'm still going to be me. Do you get what I'm trying to say? Like, I'm not going to hold it in or mm. act like, you're not going to hear me. And I'm not going to say also, sly and things. Be, I'm not and that's say also sly being stuff. real as well. Yeah, I'm not going to say sly sometimes stuff. sometimes things, people that like things don't blood clot trigger them when they know they do. I block bitches for shit like that. Do you understand? Mm. When I had my shit going on with certain people and I see them in the comments of the other people and they're supposed to be mine, I'm like, well, mm. what are we doing oh, over yeah. here? Oh, so you're with them. And them, them. Do you know what I mean? You're over there. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Sometimes it just has to be like that. I'm not going to be, I'm not going to beat around the bush or just sit like, I'm not going to say sly stuff or say little dumb stuff like mind game stuff like, oh, it's like even, um, I see, um, one episode that came out the other day and I see it's something about the really stuff we've ever spoke. I ain't even clicked in it. I saw they'll do nothing. And I mm. thought, who'll do nothing? But straight away that trigger, I thought, who'll do nothing? I'll do yeah. it all. <laughs> it can't be me because I'll do it all. I'll do the mad thing and go to the bin. Like, just not no more. I know I'm going mad. But I'm saying, straight away, I just thought, oh, they talk to Mike. Mike, you need to sort this out. Because <laughs> I'm i so... Mm. In tune with my gangster, I don't, you get what I'm saying? Straight away, I'm thinking, they'll do nothing. Must be talking about Mike. Do you get what I'm saying? They're talking about Mike again. Do you get what I'm saying? Because I saw the train drive, like, you'll do nothing. No, bro. Like, and if any time I'll do nothing, it's because I don't want to do nothing. Let's get that right as well. 
Do you get what I'm saying? It's because I don't want to do nothing. Because the second I want to do something, that something will be done. Do you know what I mean? Because I'm Mr. Real in the most. And I've done it before. Do you get what I'm trying to say? Anything that I might want to do, <laughs> I've done it before. Like, do you know what I mean? So let's not get that part um, twisted either. Do you know what I mean? It's like riding a bike. If I want to ride a bike again, <laughs> you get what I'm saying? I'll jump on a bike and I'll ride it. I haven't forgotten how okay. to ride it. Anyways, yeah, so... Yeah. Um, mm-hmm. Do you know what I mean? Getting back to... The, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I was telling school in it. Really the most. So <laughs> I was just telling realized, school in it. That's what I was saying, isn't it? Like, it's cool, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Yeah. Huh? Like, but just stop doing silly stuff. I'm not involved in all of that. Let's just all just be happy. Let's all be big men and grown and stop all the mind games and all this foolishness because I'm only going to bring it to the surface because I can't help it, innit? So, do you know? But, yeah, man, I like what... I do will say, I like um, what you're doing over there. Do you get what I'm saying? Like, but I just want... Yeah, just big up everybody homage, what they're you know what big up everybody what they're doing. Just pay some homage because you could be doing some bullshit in it, but you're not. But what do I mean? do know is burglars don't go to empty houses. Huh? A burglar doesn't go to an empty house. Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? Mm. So um I've done a couple of shit burglaries though. <laughs> no, but if you keep going back mm. if you go somewhere and you go back again. Mm. The belly's obviously there, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Do you understand what I'm saying? If you keep going back repeatedly, what does yeah, that man. say? Yeah, so man, they're learning off the man, them, you get me? Do you get what I'm saying? Big you lot up, though, man. Like Big I sense. said, like I right. said, um, they started before, man, and they was actually one of my inspirations as as far as when you was saying about doing the um, podcast thing. Because mm. remember, you told me about this podcast thing before they even started. Yeah, I was going to... No, that. There. She Come told on. me about that before they even started. But I just weren't on that. Mm. So when I've seen Pounds start it, and he's... I, I actually liked it. I hadn't watched it. No, but I, I was watching, I liked like, it. I was watching American ones. I watch, I was watching Joe Budden, you know, Drink Champ. You know what I'm saying? And a few other girly ones. Like, do you get what I mean? No, I but didn't I knew even, about it. I didn't know about that one. I liked it still. You get what I'm saying, and I got it. But my I whole know thing about, is they um, just they were just doing three shots of tequila. That's the one I know about. They, no, tube them and um, tricky and lippy's thing. Oh That's yeah, it. and Ch- Chucky, tricky. Chucky obviously. Yeah. Yeah, but for the culture. Yeah. Even Chucky, I knew about Chucky, but I didn't. Yeah. No, but tune I'm talking about the ones I watched. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. I didn't tune into it, yeah. but for the culture, because lippy's funny, isn't it? Um, so yeah, them and. For the culture is where I got the idea to do a different subject. Okay. That's where I got the ideas for subjects. And for the culture, because I noticed they would talk about a different subject each time. Mm. So but that's all of the other stuff, idea. we just brainstormed it. Do yeah, you we brainstormed like, oh, I'm just saying, so I'm just saying things. What we should I've, do a um, you know dilemma. What I mean? Do you get me? I got that I from them. those ones. You know, do you get me? But um, pounds, I like, but my whole thing is it was a whole different, it wasn't what they're doing now. It wasn't. And that's the truth. It just wasn't. Do you know what I mean? Like, it was just you two chatting, like, how we're chatting now, week in, week out. But it weren't different guests. So, as far as I'm concerned, like, man should be giving us ratings because we've upped your game, bro. Mm. We've made your podcast better. We've improved it. Do you get what I'm saying? So, really, we should be getting our flowers, you know. And, yeah, soon, hopefully, we'll get... Pounds and Doug here, yeah, and we'll have a chat. You get what I'm saying? We'll have a chat. I'm going to bring my machine, man. You get me? But I'm going to leave a you outside with it. You get me? So I'll do the physical thing in, in here. No, I'm joking, man. But yeah, um, nah, man. But it's all it's all good, man. You get what I'm saying? Man, you get what I'm saying? Really, the most, but I say what I want. You get me? Man can't page me, blood. You get me? Man's gonna have to just move to me. You get me? You know, take no pages, blood. You get me? Um, I'm going mad again. Yeah, I do think so. A little oh. bit. Um, yeah. Whatever, man. But, um, Every episode we have a different there dilemma. There we go. Yeah, you know I'm saying. <laughs> Every episode we have a different dilemma. Like, but you know what, though? Mm, go on, talk. Like I said, big up everyone. Yeah. Doing their podcasts and mm-hmm. all these things. You get mm. me, Carl? We have to. We have to still. Um, we have to be role models. 
Yeah, yeah we got to be role models. But we we're staying be... real to our feelings yeah, as well yeah, at no, the same time. We we're not gonna, we're not gonna going ignore some. Yeah, not gonna keep going back and forth. But at the same time, it's the truth, innit? Mm. Do you get me? I feel like because of how much times you've mentioned it, if it was something that weren't true, it would have been addressed. Because mm. I'm not going to have somebody on their platform keep telling me that I'm copying their yeah, thing when I know I didn't. Yeah, Do you understand what I'm saying? They can't. They can't. They can't tell me I'm so, talking rubbish. You know what I mean? Because they know I know. Like, cause you can see dates don't lie. You could go and check the YouTube. You've That's seen like my thing. My uploaded. dates don't lie. None you of my you stuff don't they, lie. The you episode is uploaded. It doesn't lie. See, our RTM podcast came true. Guess every time. You get every me? time I took a break. This is the best guest we've had on the show today, obviously. But we got all the guests, all the previous guests. You get me? But they can't compete with this guest we've got today. He deserves his flowers. Well, you got my every, episode. Every that episode. Got took down and re uploaded. Every episode, we have a different dilemma. This dilemma <laughs> is mental still, but. <laughs> Dear RTM Podcast Show, first of all, big up on the show. I watch it religiously. As I used to go to school with Aisheline. Who's Aisheline? Shut up. Mm. <laughs> Who's that? Quit? I don't know. Basically, one of my friends been gassing up this guy to me, saying how she's feeling him and how he's always buying her flowers and taking her a restaurant. He told her he owns one yard food shop on his ends and how he knows my baby father. He said him and my baby father are friends from school. Anyway, she wouldn't stop chatting about this guy. So I asked my baby father if he knows him and who he was. My baby dad just laughed and said that the guy is a dickhead. Oh and the guy's cousin is the one that owns the yard food shop. He also said that the guy has a wife and kids. Oh gosh. But told me not to say anything to my friend he doesn't want his name in mix up mm. I really want to tell her because all now she's still gassing up this guy but I don't want to not listen to my baby father where should my loyalty lie I'm in two minds please help and keep up the good work now big you up though for, yeah, for not just running they say, in I want to know who it was because they went to school with me <laughs> big you up for not just running and just yeah running them out at least you're asking for advice but yeah I say this to your baby father. What were you saying? If your baby father told you something and said, "Don't say," you don't want it. You get what I'm saying? He don't want his name and mix up. Then yeah, just come on. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, you, got you, you don't need to. You don't need to tell her. You don't need to tell her what your baby father said. You could say other stuff to try and take her mind away from dealing with him. You know what I mean? Like, mm, mm, mm. you know what I mean? Like, babe, like, obviously, like, or something else that mm, you've mm, noticed mm, on him that's mad. You get me? Mm, you can mm. say that to her, like. Oh, Seeing his teeth, or I don't know, have you seen his lips? Like, have you seen his lips? Have you seen his teeth? Di- don't whatever, I don't myself. know, just say something. I know, why for that? But don't. I but, um, why do I, got, I need to wire myself? <laughs> but, um, you know what I'm saying? Just find a different way to. Because you know what it is with them situations, yeah? You can't swear it for the girl if she's not going to say where she got it from. Do you understand? If it's a you, Mo- you more, you're gonna G it up. More times in those told situations, you, you're gonna say, say so and so told me. Da, mm. da, 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 da. Do you understand what I'm saying? And then his name's involved in that kind of stuff. Do you get me? So, boy, I don't know. But then again, she might want to tell her brethren because he's got a wife and kids, so she's getting played right now. Do you get me? He don't even have that business. Do you get me? So that's all a lie. Mm. Yeah, no. So what's your advice? What's your advice to her? Because my advice is just to be for the don't say that, I mean. Yeah, don't say nothing. Don't say nothing. So if it's your bridge, you know, you're going to, it's not. There's other ways around it, but I don't think you should just go blatantly going to tell her what the baby father said. The baby That's what father, I'm saying. The baby I don't father mean that she's like that. Don't mean that your well. bridge. Don't mean that you're not going to work on your bridge in finding out or whatever. If you got, if you love off your friend or whatever, but yeah, don't say nothing. The baby father moving like dummy though. Why are you just talking up the things? Moving like a little bad puss or. No, she's asked him who yeah, is no, no, he. So he, he most no, probably saying, said no that he ain't. No, but I'm saying no, but all of that. But then you're saying all the extra stuff. So why not say nothing then? Don't be saying all of that. Then say don't say nothing though. But I'm checking it. Like 
Like, just, yeah, just say what you're saying, man, because your baby father's getting mad. Tell your Bridget, for real. Tell your Bridget, man. What would you say, Deco? Tell your Bridget. He ain't got a mic, so you have to talk loud, because oh. I noticed that oh. as well. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. He's going mad though, he's saying he owns the yard food shop and that. And it's his bridge in his food <sighs> shop. So he's probably going in there and getting beer free food on, on this chin of his bridge and just Exactly. Moving, he's a liar. Moving, like, say, he's, yeah. he's a liar. Moving liar. like his bridge is his worker. Mm. They moving like his bridge is his worker, like these times he's his bridge is shot. Yeah, I just got him running the shop. I don't think she should say what the bridge what the what the what the baby father said. But she should she can do something else. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, no, I kind of changed my mind and just say what the baby father said. Like, For real? Yeah, you're talking too much. But he told her not to say. Yeah, but what's that about? What type He's of telling her. She's asking him. Yeah, I know, I know, but yeah, but don't say nothing. I'll say, but I'll say, I'll say rags. You get what I'm saying? Like, you could say whatever because he's a chief mm. dickhead from my school. You get what I'm saying? Like, do I care if he knows I'm saying he's a dickhead from my school mm. and he's got a wife and kids? Nothing to do with me, like I'm just telling you something. Yeah, you mashed up his thing now, innit? it? No, but I'm just telling you something. As my girl or my baby, man, I'm telling you something. I don't care, innit? I'm not, I'm not gonna tell it to you like I'm trying to mask anything. You get me? But I get it. You get me? He, I get where he's like. He don't want the. He don't want the, his name in mix up. But then, don't be mixed up. Mm. You get what I'm saying? Cause why you even say that? It, 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 because you got something called, we call it the man code. The G broken the man code. So, why are you even telling on the next man that you got wife and kids? What did that have to do with it? He's talking about the yard food shop. You're giving extras. You're giving that extras. <laughs> giving that extra yeah, stuff. He's giving a lot of information. Yeah, you're giving that it. extra stuff. So, don't try and give that extra stuff and then hide behind it. Like, oh, yeah, but don't say nothing. Like, what are you on, brother? <laughs> do you get what I'm saying? Just for that alone, yeah. you need to. You, she, Tell your Bridget, you get me? I want to see ah uh, your baby, because your baby father might be the dickhead. That's the maddest thing. You know, if he, you, he's saying my man's the dickhead, but he might be the dickhead now for my man. That's mm -hmm. why he's saying don't say nothing, car. You get me? So mm. tell him, tell you, tell your Bridget, like, yeah, boom. And let's see what happens. Yeah, and just, you know, she patterned already. Look, <laughs> she patterned back. I thought, I thought you don't tell him. Not no, telling. because now I want to see, innit? Mm. Like, why are you saying no, <laughs> innit? Do you get me? You just batted. mix up, you know, nah, getting you me all, batted, getting in the batted. mix up. But yeah. Tell him, man. You get me, tell, tell your bridging car. Your friend, wouldn't you like your friend to tell you? Yeah, I would, but. Car, what type of friend is that? Car, I would like my I'm saying, if I look at it on the opposite side, I'd like my bridging to tell me over there being mother. Like, do you get what I'm saying? It don't matter if it's your... Like, I'm your bridging. Don't have to me be, out here. It, it, don't have me out here on some foolish thing, like, with some girl just chatting shit to me. These times, she got a fucking... Uh, she got a, um, a man and and whatever, and you're not telling me my, like, my bridging. That's how I have to look at. Friendship is still, like... There's a purity that needs to be kept in friendship as well. For it to be... Do you get what I'm saying? Like, uh, what do you mean? Like, and your, your baby father is supposed to respect that. That's my bridging. Also, the uh, another don't say what, what what your what the thing about it is is you got to weigh it up in it. Who's the information gonna benefit more? Like you know what I'm saying, it's gonna benefit the friend knowing more in it because with that information she can dodge a big bullet. With him, with 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 the girl exposing what the boy, what the man said, it's not like he's going to leave her over it or it's yeah. going to cause a big whatever. Like, it's the bigger impact up, like, is the better, for the better up, good is the fact that she knows who he is. Which is not that I'm, not that I'm backtracking wholly, you know, because I said that she don't have to throw the baby father under the bus. He's already said he's just a find out. from his school, No, I'm not so saying yes. That's what I said. I don't like, mind. I don't get why mm. he's even... If he's a dickhead, then what? That's what he said, in it? He's a dickhead from school. he's a dickhead from his school. Like, well, then, yeah. My man's saying, like, yeah, he knows her baby father, so... No, nah, man. G him, G, G him up, man. All safety. You get me? Yeah, Shoot G him that up. messenger. G him up. You get me? Shoot that messenger, man. <sighs> Type up. But, yeah, boom. Every episode, we have a book suggestion. 
Last episode, big up, I'm Target. But yeah, this episode got something called Toxic Childhood. Yeah. How the modern world is damaging our children and what we can do about it. This is by Sue Palmer. Mm. This is the book that sparked an international debate. Mm. You get me? Just because of the um, title. title alone, yeah. yeah. But yeah, what's happening to children? Why do one in five now suffer from mental health problems? or behavioural and learning difficulties. In this important and groundbreaking book, Sue Palmer presents wide-ranging research on the toxic cocktail... Oh, why cocktail, man? Why for that? On the toxic of factors affecting children's lives today. She also provides sound advice on detoxifying childhood, including the vital importance of real food, and real play for children's development, why sleep is essential to learning, and how to ensure children get enough of it, childcare and education, what works best for different age groups, protecting children from aggressive marketing and the excesses of celebrity culture, and the dangers and benefits of growing up in a multimedia electronic village. A super child Rearing manual, rearing, why? Founded in science and bolstered by much reading, a lot of interviews, and most importantly, perhaps a long career in education, says T.S. Extensively researched, fluently written, and easily read. A guidebook for parents, grandparents, and all who care about present and future generations. The Tribune says that. But yeah, I think it's a great subject. It's yeah. something you should really. You know, if you've got some time, especially if you've got kids, um, yeah, have a read. You get me? Toxic childhood, how the modern world is damaging our children mm -hmm. and what we can do about it. Because I do agree with her. I think the modern world is damaging our children and it's clear to see. So, yeah, I think it's been damaging our children. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, thanks um, for rocking with us again. Do you know what, though, yeah? Ain't done um the um things for a while, but I'll do it the next episode. How about that? I'm gonna do all the um PayPal's that I've missed out. So yeah, can we send us some more PayPal's please? Yes, please. Start doing that. Um Ibrahim, where are you, man? Ain't yeah, seen you. Yeah, well go on, Ibrahim. Yeah. Get me. You up though. Big up, big up everyone, big up all the comments, big up all the comments as well. All um, the supporters, all the everyone supporters. that I see. Big up San, big up. Deco. Yeah, come on. Um, big up the day. The Great Syndicate Studio. <laughs> yeah, the Great oh, Syndicate forgot, Studio. <laughs> we forgot. The Great, Great, not Grey. Great. Great Syndicate Studio. Yeah, Deke so. Like up in it. Come yeah, on, man, you know the vibes. You know, we got some good feedback, Deeks, about they liked how yes. it looked. You get me? So. Like in the new settings, you come on. Me? They like how it looked. Um, we got good cameras. We got. We just, you know what I mean? We're just trying to just. Elevate and progress, and you get me. And I get good energy of deep. Me and Deeks have conversations. You get me. We're gonna try and pattern. You get me. Little couple sponsors and whatnot. So yeah, we just yeah, we're just here, just trying to um, do do better. We're trying to do better. You know, every day we're trying to do better. And we ain't uh, talking about everything, you know. Movements are making. Hmm? Just know. All right. Yeah. Well, follow the queen. <laughs> Ice cream, the poster girl on Instagram. Follow my business page, um, poster girl lashes, poster girl underscore lashes on inst on Instagram. Queen Ice Cream TV on YouTube. Um, queen Ice Cream on on Twitter. Follow me at big underscore bird underscore spray on Instagram. <laughs> No reason whatsoever but to just add up the following because I still can't get into that page. Follow me on Twitter at young underscore spray. Follow the podcast page at RTM Podcast Show. Mm -hmm. Follow the clothing at really the most at RTM Clothing Original. Yeah, I got the new, um, I got new stock there still, but I just not promoting it too much because it's still summer and I got like, yeah, the tracksuits and all that, but yeah. It's the last time I'm going to get them. So, yeah, get onto the website, www.readathemost.com. 
and get your track suits ready for the summer or the autumn. And yeah, thanks for rocking with us. Le Damos. Mm-hmm.